All right, welcome, welcome. Oh, I don't even know what the game is. It uh, doesn't matter. New killer. It's exciting. It's Freddy, guys. It's Freddy Krueger. The new. No, just kidding. Oh my fucking! What is that? The spirit. Oh oh. Oh my god, alright, let's read it out. So, a face walking killer, able to catch survivors off guard with her traversal power, Yamaoka's hunting. Her power allows her to teleport from one place to another without being seen. Ooh, her personal perks, Spirit Fury, Hex, Hunt the Ground, and Rancor, give her tools to observe and bait survivors and deal with obstacles directly in her path. Alright, let's see what she looks like. She's got a fucking... Oh my god, look at those. Her leg is completely severed. Her arms too. Oh my god, this looks... This looks really cool. She might have two stances or something, judging from... Her movement. My goodness. My, my goodness. I, I honestly thought it... I didn't know. Let's read up on the lore. Rin was the only child of a Yamaoka family. She was raised in the dusty halls of a traditional house in Kagawa. She started education at Takamatsu, a private university which weighted heavily on her family's shark fi sharky fi shaky finances. Her mother got ill that year and the bills started piling up. Rin worked part-time in a futile attempt to help lighten the load. Her father faced a debt that grew without end. He started working double shift in hopes of obtaining a promotion. That's when the that's when he started losing sleep. A dark whisper would keep him awake all night, reminding him reminding him of his hopeless situation. Exhausted, he started to lose grasp of reality, fighting to the night with the voices whisper at night. Rin's father made a desperate move. He met with his superior and explained his situation. He begged for a phone for a bonus and advance, time off, anything. His request was denied. The company had launched a defective production line that was costing them debt dearly. Someone had to be held accountable and Rin's father fitted the bill perfectly. He was fired after the 22 years of service. That evening, Rin came home from her work. She'd stayed late to entertain the customers that lingered at the restaurant. As she parked her bike in the shed, she heard her mother's screams for the house, from the house. She rushed in, climbing up the stairs to her parents' room. There she found bits and pieces of her mother on the floor. Her limbs were clean cut, tangled up in an unnatural position. Her breasts were sliced up, revealing her ribcage, which was cracked open. Rin gagged. A sharp katana came crashing down. Rin blocked the blade, which bit into her bare forearm. The shock of recognition interrupted her pain. Her father was wielding the katana with a stoic expression. She cried out to make him spell, but he slashed her arm again. She rushed off and slid the blood smear floor. Using the door from a support, she raised herself up. The katana ripped through the wall, cleaving her other arm. She screamed in pain as she limped into the hallway, only to be met by her father's blade. She stepped back, trembling, as she held together the salt, loose flesh of her abdomen. Images of her mother tangled limbs flashed before her eyes. Range cha charged her at her father, making him stumble back. He punched her from her torn abdomen as she reclined in pain. As she struggled to get back up, she sl he slashed her thigh, making her collapse on the floor. As she crawled towards the stairs, he grabbed her hair and yanked her against the partition. The glass shattered on impact and she fell through, landing on one, landing one floor down. She heard footsteps somewhere above her. With effort, she moved, warming her way into a sea of broken glass. The shards gnawed at her, ripping her flesh. He had to be stopped. He would not get away with that, what he'd done to her. With what he'd done to her mother. Coughing up blood, her chin grazed the glass, adding to the bleeding. A low-pitched heartbeat started to, write, to ring in her ears. Her body felt so heavy she could no longer move. The ground shook with her father's footsteps. She knew, but she was not going to make it. But she no longer cared. She would make him pay, in this life or next. A dark fox slowly veiled her eyes, but it could not subdue her rage. She would not rest, not yet. A darkness whispered, promising blood and revenge. An oath was made and Rin closed her eyes. Ooh, okay. That's pretty spicy. So we can already tell that there's some kind of blocking perk, a hex perk, and perhaps an obsession perk? Okay, let's have a look at her perks. This is, this is crazy. Spirit Fury. Each pallet you break magnifies the wrath of the entity. After breaking four pallets, the next time you are stunned by a pallet, the entity will instantly break the pallet. 
you still suffer from the stun effect penalty. This is at level 1. I guess at level 3 it will be every two pallets? That means every third pallet, the next pallet will just break on top. Oof, that's pretty good. It could really help some killers. Let's look at the next one, which I assume is the Hex one. Hex Hunter Ground. Two trap Hex Totems will spawn in tribal. When one of the two trap Hex Totems is cleansed by a survivor, all survivors suffer from the exposed status effects for 40 seconds. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Oh my- so- So there's two of them, and one of them is trapped. And the other one is the good one. So it's almost a 50-50. What the fuck? Wait, that's right, this is a tier 1. I guess tier 2 will be 50 seconds, tier 3 will be 60 seconds. The remaining trap hex immediately becomes a dual totem. Wait a minute. Okay. So it's not it's not 50-50. There's two of them, and whenever one of them is cleansed, uh, the other one disappears, and this triggers. Oh my god. They're all tier 3. I'll check them there, but you know, I, we can kind of guess what happens. <laughs> that seems really strong. Oh my. Let's look at the last one. Rancor. You become obsessed with one survivor. Each time a generator is completed, the obsession sees your aura for 5 seconds. Okay. Each time a generator is completed, all survivors' locations are revealed to you for three seconds. Hey, Ops. You closed the door accidentally. Oh, man. Ops. Welcome. And it starts hollow. This is exciting. Once all generators are completed, the obsession has the exposed status of it, and the killer can kill the obsession. What the f- This is not even a hex perk. What? Are you fucking kidding me? Cheers, Ops. Thank you, Giles, as well. You can just straight up murder them? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. Say the best for that rank or fun for the whole fa- Yeah, this has some synergy with the other perks. Huh. Holy shit, bravo. These perks are fucking spicy. I guess he can just you could ignore your obsession the entire game then last last fucking second touch the button <laughs> that is that's gonna be spicy I feel like this perks are gonna mix for some really interesting play especially with other killers but we'll see how does this killer work let's see with her power the spirit can use her power. Yamaoka is haunting. Oh, we got another sub. Is that a gifted one? No, it's just a normal one. Four months. Thank you, Grand Lovers. Thank you so, so much. Welcome as well. Run new hex and all other hexes and make survivors play the lottery. Oh, that's so strong. I have bad news, though. Let me get back to that in a second. The spirit can use her power. Yamaoka is haunting to enter an ethereal plane and reappear at a new location. You know what? I, 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 I hate saying this, but I, I legitimately had an idea kind of like this. Where you... Oh, this is really good. It's more like... It's it's kind of like a tame traveling where you set like a marker and then teleport back to it. I had a similar idea. I'm, I'm glad they're doing something like this. Okay. So the spirit will depart her physical body, leaving behind a stationary husk. While Yamaoka's hunting is active, the spirit might traverse freely to a new location, moving at a faster rate for a short duration. She is still confined to her movement within the physical environments and surroundings. The spirit leaves the physical plane, losing sight of all survivors. She can, however, still sense the scratch marks they leave on the environment. The spirit will produce an audible cue at her current location. Right. So, this is still... It's a bit confusing. Can you hit them while you're in the spirit world? Hmm. Yeah, it's kind of like a it's kind of like a wraith that splits up. It's going to be very interesting. Shall we do it? Right, so good news is on my main account I had like a million million points to level up everything. 
Bad news is, for some reason, they they must have picked it at the wrong pos at the worst possible time. I have zero points here, which is no good. Let's see if we can buy something from the store. Oh, they've changed that, huh? Um, what? Shrine of Secrets. Hey, we could do this. Right, let's go. Connor? Okay, if we level up a tiny bit, which you should be able to do. Look, now we have 300,000. It's a better, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a head start. This is very exciting. Her design is, is 10 out of 10, really, really cool. Look at how she moves, her animation, wow. Okay. How about we just play one game with her default perks? Before we do anything. She has an amulet. Slightly increases Yamaka's hunting acceleration. Pretty standard. We need to buy everything now. Power recovery. Charge stone. I still... I still don't understand exactly what kind of pillar this will be. Was there a new survivor? Yes, yes. I actually kind of forgot. I'm pretty sure there was. Yep, I I saw him sitting down behind in the background. Let's see him. Adam Francis. Oh, he looks cool as hell. Adam was born in Rollington Town in Kingston, Jamaica. His father died in a car accident when he was two and his uncle took him in. His uncle was a strict but fair man who raised him to value education. At Kingston College, Adam discovered his father's published works, which triggers his passion for literature. In his campus, however, was known his campus, however, was known for its focus on athletics. As a shy teenager with those, with no stock in books, he was the perfect prey for bullies. What he lacked in sports, he made out in grit. He learned to defend himself in the thick of it. It's during these years in college that he started to imagine his life elsewhere. Whilst his close friends orbited the music industry, he followed a surer path. His grades granted him admission to a higher education, and there was a demand for teachers abroad. After graduating university, he taught extra classes to afford applying fees overseas. He had a steady diet of long commutes, grinding piles, nightly lesson plans, and early classes. After a year, he managed to apply for a position abroad. His first plane ride took him to southern Japan for a new start. His life in, Ken in Kagoshima was hectic. There was little time to do everything he took, for he took for granted back home. His Japanese was elementary at best, which slowed him down. Buying groceries took hours, long commutes had to be planned, and lessons... Uh, plans relied on Japanese notions which he had to learn. But after a few months he found, he found his rhythm. He reflected on it one morning while reading the train to work. He no longer had to study the kanji characters filling them up. He knew his way. His language skills had improved. He felt connected to his students. And he trims himself to luxurious restaurants on weekends. He even had his first vacation plan. Within seconds Adam's world had, was brought down to a slow motion. Rails hissed, backs came pouring down, and the floor trembled before the head. Adam crashed forward as the train flipped upside down. He landed on a window pane as an unhinged door came flying at a passenger. He rolled over so that the door would hit him instead of the girl. He shut his eyes and he braced for impact, but nothing happened. He squinted one eye open and saw nothing but darkness. A heavy fog had taken over the train. Eyes seemed to flow through his body, reaching his lips first, and then the tip of his fingers before spreading to his legs. Lulled by the warm hum of the dark whisper, he closed his eyes, drifting. No one truly knows what happened to Adam Francis. The school teachers imagined the worst. Oh. Um... Sorry. When they watched the train derailment on the news and saw he was missing. Their fears seemed to be confirmed when Adam's bag was recovered from the crash site, but his body was never found. To this day, his uncle believes that Adam took off after the train crash, still alive, somewhere out there. Interesting. Dude looks pretty cool. <laughs> kind of looks like an old-time detective. Diversion. An activatable perk. Standing within the killer terror radius while not in a chase for 45 seconds activates the perk. For 45 seconds, I guess this lowers down in, in tier 3. Once the perk is activated, press the active ability button while crouch and motionless to throw a pebble, which creates a loud noise notification for the killer at a distance of 10 meters. Distance 10 meters. Oh, you can actually throw it up to 10 meters. Huh. This is, this is cool. This is so unlike anything. Deliverance. Oh, after performing a safe hook rescue on another survivor, your perk activates. You now have a 100% chance to unhook yourself during the escape attempt. What?
What? The broken? What's a broken status effect? The broken, broken hook? No way. Let's read this through this. Let, let's read through this again. After performing a safe hook rescue on another survivor, the perk. This is such a bad idea. If someone's running this perk, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna let them rescue anybody. Oh, it's a no miter. Oh. Haha. <laughs> okay, so there's a trade-off. There's a trade-off. You know. <laughs> Man, this is gonna be a nightmare for killers. I can already fucking see. Right, so if you save someone successfully, then you can escape your own hooking. If it's your first hook, of course. If it's not, then whatever. And then you can be healed for like close to two minutes. Maybe less with, you know, higher tiers of the perk. Autodidact. You start the trap with a minus 20 progression penalty for skill checks to heal survivors. What? Hmm. Mm -hmm. So essentially, you start off a bit slower healing, but after doing one successful one, you're you're faster with skill checks, and then you can, well, you're the same speed, and then you can be faster. Well, that's a really odd one, huh? I understood it, but it's kind of weak. I think so, yeah. Hmm. Welcome, Arctus. This is really cool. Really spices things up. Man, oh man. I'm so excited. Right. So, let's go back to Killer. This is the new Killer, if you guys just tuned in. And she looks fucking sick. Look at her limbs. It's so cool. Anyway, we're gonna buy a, star, a lot of stuff. Frequency of passive facing. This has no description? No. Cover. You know what? We could just buy everything. Yeah, we can. We're gonna buy everything. Since we kinda have to. And then, we will read everything when we have... When we have it in the menu. How about that? We'll just get this over with. Imagine Blood War then with that other perk. Holy fuck! Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. Alright, we've reached level 10 now. We're gonna be able to have like only a handful of perks, unfortunately. But hey, it's better than starting with nothing, so that's nice. Almost there. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's a good call, actress. She kind of does, doesn't she? Oh, we got very rares. Losing the stabs. I'm I'm super happy about this. I don't know about you guys. Yamaka's hunting duration. Oh, we'll do we'll buy a Mori. We might be able to use it. Right, so that's all we can use. Let's see what we got. So devour hope could be good. Monitor, why not? Spirit Fury. I wanna see what that's like. Hunt the ground. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna bring her personal perks into this. I'm not gonna use Rancor just yet. I want to understand that one better. Right, uh, no add-ons, so we know what the hell it is we're fucking doing. And some blood points. How about that? Uh, Alright, let's go. Hopefully we'll get a game. 
The, the girl from Georgia with the hair stun. Yeah, her hair is really cool. I wonder how they did it. It looks really dark. It looks pretty rad. Oh, the customization thing has been changed a bit. I wonder if she's got things in store. Characters. Spirit. No, nothing. Uh, nothing new for this guy. So. Damn, I, I saved so many blood points. I guess I did it too late. I started with like none. But if we level up just a bit, we can buy another teachable from the shrine and get a bunch of points. We need to play a bunch. Background description for killers too. They do. Uh, See? We just read it like a minute ago. <sighs> oh god. Uh, oh, we're not creating a lobby. There you go. At rank 1, you probably have some trouble on level 15. Ah, uh, no, that's alright. I'll probably have trouble, you know, actually understanding the character. But Is she good? She's amazing. I have no clue. We're about to try her. So, let's read on her power again. It's basically like... Uh, She's caught a wraith-like power. Okay, let's read it again. Tap and hold the power button to charge. Kinda like the wraith. The spirit might traverse freely to a new location. Yeah, it's not, it's not at all what I thought it was. The, question, the big question is, can you hit survivors while you're a spirit, even if you can't see them? Because if you can, I can see perks such as Predator being really useful on her. Predator, like, tightens the scratch marks, so Predator could be strong on her if, we, if you could do that. But right now, we're just speculating. Will we find someone? We'll see. Uh, yeah, Perk Slice, and we just read the story. Uh, you can see that she's got a bunch of uh, glass shards stuck on her body. Yeah, it, it's explained. You appear fast. Right, let me read it again. Okay, this is the thing that confused me. I thought that when you stood in place and you enter the ethereal world, ethereal world, you had to teleport back to where you started, but apparently not. It really is kind of like a wraith. You, you, you become invisible and then you move, but you're when you come out, you're still there. Are you gonna try the new survivor too? Of course. We might have to do that first, since it seems like we're not finding anybody. Raid doesn't leave his body. Yeah, what's the point of leaving her body? If she doesn't come back to it. I... Yeah, I'm a bit... I'm a bit... I'm a bit confused, if I'm honest. Anyway, it's gonna be really unfortunate if we can't fucking find anybody. So why is there still a husk? Yeah. Yeah. We'll have to... We'll have to understand. Did Freddy get any buffs? No, not yet. The person that did get buffs is... The Hilt? No. The Ray. I, I have a bunch of items that I haven't used. Ooh. So it's time to read them all, huh? Coxcomb Clapper. It renders the Wailing Bell completely silent. <laughs> That's pretty nice. Blind Warrior White. The Biker Cryo Symbol. Represents Ferocity. Surprise attacks and flicks survivors with mangled and hemorrhage until fully healed. Ooh. disappearance stone. Alright. Okay. 
Wait, this is completely different. Mm, Windstorm is now like a... It's kind of like the death engravings for Hillbill. It just gives you more speed to traverse from place to place. Hmm. Horror of blindness. Jesus. Okay. Bone club. This is the this is the meme one. Hmm. Ah, uh, we're missing some. We're missing some items, actually. The hound. Hmm. Okay. This is interesting. This is actually kind of interesting. Yeah, Chubby, that's what I thought. I assumed that the husk was more of a telltale for survivors than an actual asset for the killer. That's fine. That's kind of cool. What's not so cool is the fact that we might get fucking no games. Damn. How did it take me... How did he catch me at zero points but still rank one? Damn. Why is the blink out on in this blink but the other ones aren't? What do you mean? Oh! Yeah, that's this. Yeah, you mean with the little slashes? That's definitely uh, that's definitely an error uh, formatting. Uh, good catch. We might have to play survivor, guys. That's so unfortunate. New killer, yeah. Welcome, Felicia. Yeah, here she is. She looks hella cool. She looks pretty small too. Unfortunately, yeah, we're gonna we're not gonna be able to play her. What happens if we play survivor? Wait, he's got two jackets? Oh, it's just a slight variation. Alright. I like this guy. I'm sure we'll find a game immediately. Or maybe not. Do you guys not- What? Do you guys know what he do? Yeah, there's a killer. Crusher. So she's basically Gretch? I suppose, yeah. I actually don't know so much about the Gretch, but... Hmm. Love your streams. Keep up the great work. Thank you, Crusher. Crusher. <laughs> Oh, man. We might have to play private games or something at this rate. <laughs> Look at this fucking guy. Alright, I guess we're gonna play against the killer. Probably. Before we do anything. <laughs> that perk is so fucking evil. Can you imagine this? I'm sorry, but I think I I think it might make the game worse. As a killer, I'm gonna be so paranoid now. You actually have to be paranoid about a few things already, right? You need to make sure they don't have that hard, you need to make sure they don't have decisive, unbreakable, all those things. And now it turns out that they can you could be defending a guy for like 20 minutes. And they could just copy themselves off the fucking hook last second thanks to their perk. Ooh, that'll be tough. They'll be running the new guy too. I don't care, like <laughs> I don't care. I just I just wanna learn it. We might have to play with a with friends or something. Which perk? It's a new perk called Deliverance. It grants you an automatic escape from the hook the first time when you make a safe when you make a safe unhook. So yeah, as a killer now you might just not want to let them go for a safe unhook. Perfect perfect Taylor. Not really. <laughs> but yeah, Taylor used to go for saves very often. There's a new map as well. 
No way. Did they nerf the decisive yet? No, I don't think so. New part kind of counts as decisive though. Oh yeah, it does. TJ. Oh, I didn't even think of it in that way. Okay. All right, let's get ourselves an item. Is that her? That's her right there. Ah! Run! She's cutting up my fucking homies. Oh, so that's her husk. I'm like, why is she standing still? The new killer basically sits still. You see them standing still, but they're actually like teleporting. They're pulling a, a literal Omae oh Wamomo on you. We don't know what it feels like, but now we know what it looks like. Look, she's gonna stand still in a second. Yup. And she's probably coming. Maybe. I don't see you. Where is she? I'm scared. There she is. She cut me up! Help me! <laughs> There's no exit here. Oh no! <laughs> no, I'm so bad. Oh, and I wasted my perk too. <laughs> Save me! Brother! <laughs> Her animations are a bit wonky. Am I just safe me? Oh, if I have been struggling from day one. No, you guys did so well. I'm pretty sure he's got the same noise. Yeah, the same grunt as David. David Tab. Oh man. Feels not that strong. He might. She might have a lot of mind game potential. She can't see your body. Oh, she really can't. I didn't even think of that. I had already forgotten. Mind you. He has ponies. Wow. Yeah, this is like Tab's son. <laughs> He's more of a detective than Tab. She seems like a bad nurse. Well, yeah, her power doesn't immediately scream super OP, but... Be right next to her. Yep, she's coming. Hmm. This might actually be one of the more. It might have a really high skill cap. I'm, I'm trying to call it now. Because if you can't see survivors. It would really be down to guesswork about where they are. So people who are really good at sort of anticipating where you are without actually seeing you, maybe they could play this color to some neat extent. Oh. Seems really cool. I'm excited. Oh, we need to do more gents where are they? Does nurses calling work on face walk? That's a great question. Wow. Wow, if it does. That'd be neat. Auto reading in general, does it work? We don't know. Doesn't look very good. I got no skills. Okay. Yeah. That looks fucking horrible. Wow. You guys messed up a bit, huh? Hey, Wyatt. Hey, no. No need to use such language. Oh, he used the Kobe. Yikes. 
He saved. He saved his teammate though. I'm gonna. I need to. I need to go help a brother out. No. Oh! Heal up, brother. I'm on my way. There's no way we'll make it out of here. There's absolutely. I'm sorry, guys. I thought you would be closer to being healed. I'm doing great. Welcome, guys. Oh, God. I don't even have self care. Jesus. Oh, what happened? Oh. He also copied himself and then got hit immediately. <laughs> well done. Hey, what's popping? Maybe time to fucking run? If you're injured, she can follow blood. Oh, she's following my blood, isn't she? Oh. Well, Dwight. It was nice knowing you. I'm gonna hope for a medkit. <laughs> and hope she doesn't have barbecue. <laughs> Damn. I don't think I can hit the killer with this. I'll go around and try to get him. Oh, he killed himself. Alright. If you fail the repair, the killer is elected to your position? Yes. That that happens with almost anything. If you fail a skill check... Uh... Oh! oh. If you fail a skill check doing pretty much anything, you're... you're fucked. This killer's onto my ass! Hatch, please! I see the hatch! I see the hatch! Not the way! Uh, let's see what happens. Alright, easy game. That was so pathetic. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> uh, that was... That was scary. Great match. Great match. In the PTR. Saying that. I'm joking. Have we tried the new killer? Let's try to do that now. He took me seriously. Hi, the scumper. Welcome. Uh, let's see if we can play killer. The Vower Hope is gonna be such a good perk. With the new fucking thing. Let them go for safe unhooks. And just... No, then again. If they unhook themselves, you don't get tokens. Oh man, the Vower Hope is actually not a good counter at all. This is painful. All around me. <laughs> Four hex. That I don't mind, man. You can literally have five, five perks, five hexes, uh, five hex totems, two from this and like three from, oh god. <laughs> what does this killer do? She turns invisible kind of like the wraith, but it works kind of different. Empty game, lonely. Yeah. Why won't I be able Can I just rank? Can, why won't you put us all in the same rank? No, I can't play her. Can you read her backstory again? Yep. Rin was only a child and then she died. Uh, she's basically a Japanese girl who was born in a really... She was in a family without much money and she had to work really hard. Her dad had to work really hard and one day he just fucking snapped and killed her mom and killed her. And she was like, 
Yeah, I know. I don't like that. Kill your friends? If you guys get on with this, I'll play with you guys. Because this is kind of sad. Wow. Mr. Welcome. Let's see what happens. Let's go pull your friends, see if it's possible. Oh, okay, some of you are here. I'm gonna send some invites, see if anybody wants to join. TTJ is here. Okay, I sent some invites. And let's, let's see the perks at their strongest. Right. Okay, let's select her three perks. Okay, so Hex Haunted, yeah, it's as I anticipated, 60 seconds. Rancor, they only see you for three seconds. Mind if I bring someone? If you're fast enough. Two pallets, wow. Okay. Oh god. Let's see your add ons. Oh, the blood trails are not visible normally. Oh, so she can't see blood until you use this add on. Passive phasing. What's the difference between passive and non passive? Lucky Sashi Saya. We'll play without add ons. How about that? Um. Sure. Okay. Oh, and we can check the new map too. Family residence. While the Yamaoka State displayed a glorious past. Hmm. Map mirror. Ready up, buckos. Okay. This will be interesting. I'm so happy we can play with duos. Otherwise, yeah, we wouldn't be able to play this at all, huh? New map. Oh boy. I don't know if being in a new map benefits the killer or survivors more. I guess the killer. Because when there's chaos, killers always have the upper hand. But we'll see. They're gonna stream snipe. They're be worse. Come on. Yeah, they probably will. <laughs> All right. What? Who's that? AJ Goof. Thank you so much for the fifty bits. Do you say something? A jugo off. Yeah. <laughs> A jug of OG. There you go. Yeah. What the hell, man? When it's all in caps, I can't read names. Please let me know what you will do so I know how to survive and not die. Thank you. I'm going to be playing this killer for the first time. I have no clue what's going to happen. I must say that one of her perks is kind of weird because it interacts with Bitter Murmur in an odd way. It kind of completely overrides it, almost. Yeah, what the hell is the point of Bitter Murmur now? <laughs> um, Alright, this is an interesting new map. Fair enough. Oh. oh, so her sword actually appears on head. That's very interesting. Right. So. Right here. I see. <laughs> Very interesting. Okay. So you you stand completely still. And I need to oh I need to power it up. Okay. 
Alright. Where are the scratch marks though? Shit. Okay, this is a bit it's a bit odd. But I guess I can get used to it. Oh my god, the rich- Yeah, you cannot use this power at will. Yeah, just- I wanted to use it just now. It's a bit odd. Let's see how far we can make it. Let's start over here. Gotcha. Okay. That's more like it. And the next pilot stun will be an automatic destruction. That's kind of cool. And we can't, we still can't use our power. Oh, you get a little audio cue whenever you're able to. I see him. Oh, there you are. Nice. She'll be right here. This is a cool killer. Using that, using it for that long, really makes it so that you cannot spam it, which is a bit. I guess it will take getting used to. You're right. Oh, you can see the grass. Oh, that's that makes it kind of strong, doesn't it? Interesting. All right. Very nice. Okay, we hear the whoosh, and that's our telltale that our power is ready. Wait a minute. Thought I saw something over here. Hit them with a the pointy end. Okay. Let's see how far we can make it. It's nice, it's kind of like a mixture between the wraith and the pig. I, I dig it. I kind of dig it. I can't... The... Uh, nice, good countering. Power's ready. That Q is kind of nice. And if you don't want to use it, it's kind of like a normal killer. There you are. Ooh, you need to be very careful when you use this. Like, you can tell that at base, the recharging is quite slow. What? Okay, this is interesting. The Strudel guy. 45 months late, my Strudel. Oh, come on. Thank you so, so much. That still cursed me out a bit, but thank you. Should have brought a Mari. No, this is fine. Okay. Corn will no longer be OP if you can use it to track people. I didn't get stunned. Uh, come on. That would have been... How fucking short is my short, man? There you go. I like her phasing weapon. Must have been completing gents without me noticing, because <laughs> I haven't even noticed the perk thingy. Uh, 
I got you. It kind of is like a nurse, actually. You have to guess where they're gonna be. <laughs> if you could see their blood. Now that would be a different story. Look at that. Does he see me? Who are we chasing? Go safe. Yeah. Where are we living? This isn't the new map. No, uh, we selected it, but it must have failed for some reason. Really? Wow. Running through me. So shameless. I don't want to kill this guy. We'll leave him on the ground. Okay. I see. Ooh, someone's working on that one. Let's go spook that guy. Oh. Okay, this kind of works out, I think. Check it out. Oh, they started running. Why? How do they know? Do they hear me from miles away or something? Let's look at the grass. I'll be able to mind game her here. Oh! There you are! Wow, we haven't used any of her perks, essentially. That was so good! Ugh, killed me. Nice one. He did not- he baited me really well. Alright. Let's see if we can do some damage. That was very uncharitable of them. They did not fucking fuck around. We could- Oh, hang on a second. Is that who I think it is? Uh-oh. You messed up. You messed up big time, friend. Definitely missing some animations there. Also, fuck right off! Ruining my cinematic experience. I'm gonna fucking cut you up. Nice. <laughs> Welcome, Hikari. Oh man, this was difficult. But I like it. I like it. That killer is fun. Oh, I'm gonna... I'm not gonna be so nice this time. Let's see how, how far we can push this. We'll use some basic add-ons. Um, yeah, that was weird. Right. And now we're gonna spice things up a bit. They won't be able to ignore the totems like they have. If they want to, they'll have to go through Ruin. Haunted Ground and Ruin are gonna be a really, really popular combination. 
Mark my words. I'm going to use Predator. And... That's fine. Whispers. Please take my money away. I obviously can't handle it. Well, thank it's you. Fine. Thank you, Laska. That's too sweet of you. I appreciate the donation. And all the subs and all the donations before that. Okay, the add-ons seem pretty simple. I just kind of like, kind of like Freddy. Hmm. Yeah, there, there's no variety. There's four add-ons of each kind. Okay, the, the purple one start to spice it up. Frequency of passive. What is this frequency? I will explain it, don't worry. We're gonna go into a new game. Interesting. Hmm. The spirit. What will happen there? Uh, Ichiro is our friend. He likes to tell stories and sometimes we just gather around and listen to him. But... Yeah, he shouldn't do that during a stream, of course. I don't know exactly when he's planning on doing it. Is this some Foco Japanese monster? No, not really. I mean, it, obviously it's inspired by it, but it's like a modern story. Uh, she's a, she's just a, a Japanese girl who got murdered by her family. What do you think of the new pilot perk person doing? Could, could make quick work of many pilots in like pilot heavy maps. I guess for a trapper or a pig or yeah, all these killers that really benefit of like getting rid of pilots, yeah. Game is free on PS Plus right now. It is, yeah. It's been for the for the whole of August. Ice juice time. Hydrate. All right. Ah. Right. She works a little bit like the pig, where she does. Oh, new map. She does like a bit of a of a ambush. In this ambush, she turns invisible, kind of like the wraith, and she cannot see survivors. So she has to guess where they are. We're gonna run around until we see someone, we see Whisper Stone up. This map looks fucking cool. Whisper's still off, and when, when Whisper's is on, we'll try to catch them. Where are they? Whisper's still off? Alright. Did I hear something? <laughs> What are you? What are you doing, you silly? Look at these crashers. Look how well they point out where she's going. You will not be able to escape me, my dude. I got you. Wait, only three of them loaded in. No wonder. I think I got rid of my ruin on the first attempt. Lucky bastards. Right, let's see if we can use this with Predator. Did you see her? Me neither. The power of guessing. Oh, nice try. Oh, look at this. Look at this fucking hooks. Interesting, huh? Your ready up button doesn't appear. My ready up button? Oh! Oh, you had to leave? Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh. Well, we'll try to enjoy the game. Damn, you need to be very efficient. I thought she would have started running. You need to be very fucking efficient with your. 
Rather, you need to be mindful of when you start using the power. If they don't start running, you will have a hard time finding them. Okay. You hear that little swoosh? That means the power is ready. It's just right here. What? Okay. That was pretty spicy. I'll give you that. Nice one. Wow. Did that not work at all, or...? Right, so... Predator, I think, will be a really strong perk on this... On this killer. There you go, right here. Oh, fuck, grass. Yeah, it's just still here. The new Predator is... Could be nice. How to tell where to go here, huh? Am I fucking stupid? Why? I thought you weren't supposed to see blood. Alright. I guess barbecue would be a good perk on her as well. So to repeat, when I go into the face, into the face walking thingy, I'm invisible. I make a little humming noise or something. But I can't see survivors, so I have to guess where they are. Oh yeah, uh, whispers, right. Let's see. Okay, well, there's someone in here. They're gonna be right here. What? I guess they can hear it, right? They're not completely stupid. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like I could go through there, does it? Okay. Right here. Interesting, huh? I wonder what it's like to play against it now. She's so creepy. Uh, yeah, have you seen her in third person? Her limbs and the way she moves? It's it's quite unnerving. Do you give up? Nah, I didn't give up. We are taking a bit of a break though. We'll, back, we'll be back on it soon. Probably the next- Hey! What the fuck? What are you doing, Sub-Zeros? So as soon as you start phasing, they disappear. And as soon as you stop, they appear back. You also don't see their blood. Unless you use a very rare add-on, apparently. Oh, what is it doing? Oh! I bumped onto her! That could be a good technique. To just follow their... We'll try doing that. We're gonna try to follow their... Scratch marks with Predator until we feel a bump and then we hit them. Maybe that'll work. What monster is this? This is the spirit, the newest killer on Dead by Daylight. She has a fucking sword or something. I really like it. Okay, so we have whispers on. Unfortunately, if we don't predict exactly where they are. If we turn invisible and they're not, they're not actively running or doing something, it's gonna be really hard to catch them. <laughs> that is such a fucking naughty thing to do. You saw that, I got, I got them at the very edge of my power. Make your choice with this girl. Holy shit could be really strong. Give them the illusion of safety. Nice. Oh, we bumped into her. You, you, you felt that? That little bump? Mm. Yeah, okay. We're, we're learning. This is okay. You 
I should have stopped running. This is really cool. I quite, I quite like it. Her add-ons seem a bit simple, but still. Nice one. What are you doing? Gotcha. I feel like the mind game potential for this is really high. Then again, it could also be so difficult that it will come down to like guesswork. I have a fucking sword, my dudes. Watch out. Right, so these guys were, yeah, they were uh, three against one. Not very fair. You're healing right here. Gotcha. You can heal. You can hear them. That's very important. Maybe. Oh, this is so exciting. Think about Strider, the one, the one that makes them louder when they're wimping. Strider could be really strong on this killer. Predator is strong on this killer. It feels. These perks don't get much use on any other killer. So that's that's wonderful. I don't think she can only do it twice. Maybe she only wants to do it twice. Yeah. How re how fast can you actually get out of the fucking power? That's what I wonder. Grass is really strong. Do you see that? I had no clue where he was, because he becomes invisible as soon as I start charging it. Maybe it should be as soon as you are into it fully. But I saw the little grass rumble. And then it's like, okay, he's right there. And I can catch up really fast. It's kind of like a reverse clown, too. Where instead of making them faster, have a slower, you make yourself faster for a bit. And if you do it well, you catch up. Kind of nice. No loot in chat. Oh. Okay. Didn't fall for it this time. Alright, this has been kind of educational, I suppose. It must have been really unfair for them, but... Power recharge is pretty slow. It's not a power you can spam. Hey, I hear something. I hear something healing. Somewhere. Alright. I'll fucking cut you then. Ooh. Spicy. Yeah, Kirai. Uh, but here's what happened. I was trying to do that just now. They cleansed one totem, and they were lucky enough to find the the one that was, you know, uh, that was not cursed. But here's the thing: when these people, they, they they're they're obviously talking and so on. But it's if it's only uh, a team of like uncoordinated survivors and they don't know, they'll probably cleanse the totem, not knowing what the fuck is going on. So it, it, this would probably be a stronger perk in public games. You don't, I don't want to use my power right now. When I want to use it, it's something like this. Oh man, that, that time to catch up. Gotcha! <laughs> this seems like a fun killer. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This, yeah, this guy's... We kind of slaughtered him a bit. We didn't even see the interior of this. Oh, the basement's here. How cool. Yeah, arc water. Absolutely. Look how fast we're catching up, boy! Oh my god! <laughs> that is nuts. When you've already hit someone to catch up to them that fast? Predator is, Predator is probably a good perk. Maybe not, maybe not, but it feels like it. 
Moose rest. Time goes faster than it feels. Well, I'm just here to resub. Have a nice stream, everyone. Well, thank you so, so much. Good to have you. What well, add-ons do you use? I think I used two yellow ones to make my power a little bit faster. Uh, my recovery a bit faster and my facing a bit faster. It's actually quite... This is some fucking hillbilly shit. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, this is nice. Oof. We didn't even use the strongest ones. In short, it seems like the potential of this killer really relies on your ability to... She walks so weird. Three, bury one, try hard. I'm sorry, I was just kinda... Um, I was just kinda... Um, testing the ground. <laughs> that was fun. Alright, we're gonna use Nurse's Calling, see if these things work. Okay. Rancor will be nice. People will think twice before using the size of. Man, oh man. It's gonna be really cool. Alright. So. You're, you're telling me. You're telling me that I can be fucking faster? Slightly increases the passive facing duration. Passive phasing? What is passive phasing? Mm. Welcome, Nate. Thank you. Uh, I don't know what passive facing means. Right, I'm gonna try something. Something really mean, mind you. This is like a hillbilly 2.0. Passive facing. Is that the... Can someone explain... Yes, our second phoenix. We will explain it again when we play it. Damn, some people can't ready up. Hello, Pycon. Hey, just mean welcome. Who's the new killer? It's this girl right here. The spirit. She looks creepy as fuck. And she's really cool. back. 
glasses with sloppy butcher. There's an idea. I guess we don't need whispers that badly. Ah, uh, crap. Well, they figure it out. We'll do that next time. How about that? Yeah, sick bean. It's, it's crazy, huh? I'll definitely run that on like the trapper or something. You don't even need know it anymore. Although, yeah, maybe the trapper. You don't want to get seen by one person. Hmm. Your friendless is full. <laughs> I'm very popular, it seems. Thank you. Nah, I'll figure it out. Does she have any cosmetics? No, it doesn't seem like it. In fact, some of her animations are missing sounds. What are her perks? We're gonna go through them real quick. Uh, we don't have we don't have any of them on, I think. I'm just trying to see what perks work good on her. Yep, no, no, her perks on. Uh, they're pretty mean. We'll see them. We're gonna enter whisper range very carefully. Fucking god. Do you see how fast that was? What the actual fuck? Oh my god. Right. I got gotcha. you. Right? This is where the fun begins. We're gonna put him in the farthest corner we can get him. We're gonna walk outside until Whispers is off, and that's how we'll know it will be 32 meters. Well, I think it's out of the off, but. Yep. Let's see how fast we can do this. This could be pretty scary. Oh my god, that is filthy. We just one shot this bill with make your choice. Holy shit. Put them in a corner and use this. This is fucking disgusting. Oh my god. And look, we're we can we can get that guy in like two seconds. Where is he? Did he get past us? I see- I keep seeing blood on the ground, but it's just little puddles of water. Okay, I got confused there. Okay, let's see if this works with- No, okay, nurses doesn't work. Uh, nurses probably not so useful on this killer. I mean- All right, let's let's. Oh my God! If you put them in the basement, they can't do anything. Oh my God! You're check it out. Okay, can we leave? Hello? What the fuck? Oh oh oh! The side seems to get you stuck somehow. I'm not camping, I promise. Okay, there we go. There's someone here. Oh. Laska, thank you. We are getting some merch done real fast, I promise. 
All right, let's see what it's like to chase someone with. Oh my god, that is filthy. I'm just gonna wait right here. Well, they're all injured, so who cares? It's not like they can do much. There's also hell. He's dead. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. But yeah, we can do something similar for sub. We're gonna get 32 meters away, and we can use whispers to measure that, like, exactly. So, right here. That's 32 meters. Okay, you can't, you can't just build it up. You have to wait up. There you go. Three, two, one. There you go. It's triggered. Well, he kind of got in the way, but now I now I can literally find him and one shot him. That is fucking ridiculous. They can't do. This is almost worse than the hag. <laughs> he had life. Nice. And down he goes. Oh my god! I'm so sorry. There are my little guinea pigs. That's filthy. It's it's ridiculous. You know, the, the thing about the nurse and hillbilly, what makes them strong with make your choice is the fact that they can close the gap really fast. But this fucking bitch can do it so much faster. And also, like, she doesn't need to, unlike the billy, like, she doesn't need to uh, actually, uh, you know, have a clear path. She can go around. Crazy. This is how Nurse should have been. I, I like Nurse the way she is. It's, it's okay. You're a bit strong, but... Good fucking grief. Alright, Predator is good on this. And make your choices. Okay, we're using some add-ons and stuff, but... It's borderline broken. My goodness. If you wait 32 meters away, you can go... So quickly. Same, after unhooking someone, you can... Oh. I guess wrong. Alright, let's try to be filthy again. By the time my power is up. Oh. Look at that. Look at this. What can they fucking do? Oh, the blood. Do you see him? I don't see him. That was a bad position because it wasn't very it wasn't very open, but if you put them in a corner or somewhere like open, they're kinda fucked. Did I see something move here? Oh I did. Hey! This is the man who's gonna go down in one head. You you have a full minute to hit them, mind you. Look at that! That is nuts! Are you supposed to be leaving the body behind? Uh yep. Yeah. If I walk back you'll see it. So, the way they can find me is, like, when I do this, they can see my body standing still. <laughs> if you predict them, you can give them a bit of a spook here, huh? And make your choices back, so we can use it again. Oh, no, yeah, but my power's not ready. That's okay. This person's bleeding, so... We can spook them a bit. You know what? I'm gonna go for those two. They probably won't. They probably won't realize that. Make your choice. It's still one hell of a drug. Where did I hook them? Uh. Oh, they moved. Yeah, no, no whispers. We could have hit that gen, but yeah, this is fine. Oh, whispers on. You hear that little thing? That means my power is ready. They finish healing. If I find them, I could still one shot one of them. Oh, but they hit well. Well done. Ah! 
I found him like two seconds before his thing expired, so I still one shot him. This is a scary fucking killer, and this is a really good map for her. Holy shit. Oh man. I'm so sorry. They they must be having a difficult time. And you know what the best part? We can do the same thing to Sub Zero's was probably in that thing right there. Look, I'm, I'm pretty sure I can pull it off from here. Oh yeah. Oh, she was on this corner. Alright, so I've already noticed something interesting. Phasing can be done mid-air. So if you want to save time, you could technically walk, drop from a little place. Like a little hill or something. And charge it mid-air, kind of like the chainsaw for... This might be the most complete killer of all of them. Like, she... The timing... The timing is... Oh. Yeah, she's fucked. Wow, five seconds. Check it out. Look how fast we're gonna catch up to her. Oh! Yeah. So, what is... This? Yeah, the charging acts a little bit like a chainsaw, I suppose. You have to use it well. The power recharges and requires you to, you know, be patient. Kind of like Mayu's. She's... The way you stalk can be kind of like the pick, and you have to guess where they are, kind of like the nurse. If you've played all the other killers, I feel like you have a, head of, a bit of a head start. This might be a really difficult killer to play as, as your first. Yep, I probably put it up there with the nurse. Because you have to do so much guesswork. And that, that will not happen if you don't know the maps well and all. Dude, I would be so scared to go for the save if I was them. Okay, I was punished there. I'm, gonna, I'm already gonna guess where they're going. Oh, there they are. Oh, that was bad. Remember, make your choice. Eee. Sorry. This map. I'll catch him. <laughs> you think I won't fucking catch you in 30 seconds with this? This is ridiculous. Oh, he had a good pallet. Thought I wasn't supposed to see those. Was that a glitch? Oh, maybe I won't catch him after all. Or will I? Nice. I'm gonna run out of time here. Nice. Nice! If I have been a bit faster, I would have spooked them. Okay, well, uh, it would be really interesting to see how this works. Okay, so you do see... you. I, I think I understand it. You see scratch marks that were left before the thing. But not afterwards. Oh, he's right here. I bumped into him. And remember, this is a mouse one killer, so I guess every other thing that you use with other like sloppy butcher and stuff, it all works. Where's the blood? Oh, I found you. Alright, I'm gonna try to mine again. See, this is this is quite in this is quite interesting. Oh, he's gonna make it. Not on my watch. Woo -hoo -hoo. Got you. I kind of blocked his way. Run so. <laughs> we'll go over her perks. After this, that was that was really good. Hold on, guys. He was just playing you well. No, you don't see the marks. You don't see the marks anymore. Like, look, 
Well, now I'm, yeah, this would have mattered because they can't run now. But yeah, I'm, I have an add on that lets me see blood. But it makes, it doesn't let me see marks anymore. Interesting. The passive phase walk is you maintaining your speed burst after the actual phase. Oh. I could explain it. But why the frequency? Why use the word frequency? I don't understand the con. You scared the shit out of me at the house. <laughs> this is a fun killer to play. They really have a dumb themselves. Well done. What's the face walk? We don't know. There's many things we don't know. We're gonna try to figure them out. Guys, I'm gonna invite some more people who are my friend. Let's play in this game. If you've already played a couple times and you want to leave them a spot, that would be sweet of you. Anyway. So, yeah, let's go over her perks again. Hex Hound the Ground. It's a trap perk. It puts two Hex Totems. And as soon as one of them is cleared, both disappear. Well, the other one becomes a doll. And, this is... Get a fucking load of this. And, when this happens... Uh, they're, they're, they basically have no it for 60 seconds. When they... So it's, it's like a trap hex. Really cool. Uh, next perk from the spirit. Rancor. It's an obsession perk, and it's so fucking mean. Alright, so it's got a downside. The downside is that every time they do a generator, they see you for 3 seconds. Like, all of them. Actually, no. Only the obsession. Yeah, only the obsession. And you see them for three seconds, so it's essentially a perk leaving the that leaves the obsession gives the obsession an advantage, so it can stay away from you. But at the end of the game, you can one shot the obsession, and you can moor them immediately. <laughs> what were they thinking? That is too strong. And what's her final perk? It's Spirit Fury. It's a pallet kind of perk. Uh, every time you break two pallets, the third one... Well, this is a top a top, uh, a top performance, a top level. Every time you break two pallets, the third one will just break automatically when you get stunned. Running it with Enduring, I could see it being pretty strong. Right, so we're gonna run a Strider, because that's important. We're gonna run uh, Sloppy. Yeah, Sloppy would be good with the glasses, we'll, we'll forget about that. What's some other perks we could use? Yeah, make your choice is absolutely fucking... It's fucking bonkers. <laughs> We're not gonna use it now. It's, it's, it seems a bit too strong, maybe. We'll use Predator. Predator seems nice. And what... Look at these three perks. You barely use them. I like this. And we're gonna use more normal add-ons. That's gonna be what passive facing means. Uh, let's read her power again if we can. Well, Yamaoka's hunting is active. The spirit might traverse freely to a new location. It doesn't talk about f passive facing. It really doesn't do a good job explaining it. But I'm guessing I'm guessing it really means the after the after effect of the teleport. Can you invite Jon Snow again? Uh, sure. So some of our perks are going to change the way survivors do anything. Right, I'm not gonna use... I'm not gonna use Whispers. Yeah, okay, we'll put Whispers aside, and we'll use... We'll also put Barbic. Damn, it's a difficult choice. Anyway. A! This is gonna be good. Yeah, yeah, this is good. 
This means we can use it mid, mid. This is like the combat straps for the pig. Means we can use it faster. All right. This seems like a pretty standard way to do this. What could be your foreign upper? We'll just rank her. How about that? Let's go. What are the ultra rares? Uh, one of them makes it so that you can see blood. Which is a big deal. It means that if you hit someone, uh, you can chase them by both the scratch marks and the blood. And the other one makes it so that you don't see scratch marks. It means that when you go into spirit mode, you're pretty much blind. You don't see survivors, you don't see anything. But it gives you like a massive boost of speed, which is basically turns her into a hillbilly without the chainsaw. So she's trash, I assume? No, she doesn't feel trash. She she seems quite cool. Say the best for last. That would have been that would have been nice. But then again, I don't. I think that combination will be stronger than other killers. All right. Pretty exciting. Uh, we're gonna be a chaser, not so much a, a spooker. So we're gonna find one of them, we're gonna hit them, and then... Oh. It's time to run. Yeah, that was... That was good enough, I guess. Who's my obsession? Sub-Zeros. Uh, flashlights are bugged. They don't work at all, guys. Yeah, don't bother using them. I'm sorry, I should have mentioned that. <laughs> Did he get stuck? She's like a combination of all killers. It's really cool. This map is gonna make your fucking head explode. All right, the basement's in the big house. Where are they? There they are. We're gonna catch one right here. No? What? I thought I saw one. Oh well. Pop goes the weasel. Also a good perk on this killer. Hey guys. That might have not been the best idea. Alright, let's see how our... This is how our power is gonna shine. Let's see. There you go. Wow. I'm gonna say that she's not up. People need to do more mind games and challenge As she can't see them while phasing that could create a good opening. Well I agree, I agree. This is a killer that's that's definitely gonna get a lot harder as soon as people figure out good ways to juke her. I hear you. Thank you, Strider. What? Was that the death heart? Cheeky death heart? Her source her sword feels pretty good to use. They messed up. They shouldn't have been working on the gen with the person on the hook. He's right here. Oh, oh wow, yeah, that's just me not knowing the map. Good. Alright, let's try some advanced mind games. Oh, we glitched out her sword. Gotcha. Do you see that? Her sword was... Uh, was hanging under my hand. Who's the new survivor? It's this guy. Uh, we'll have a look at him once we hook him. Uh, it's a black dude. He's American, like an exchange professor in Japan. 
I don't know. He, right now, he's not very unique because he's got David's... Um, David taps his um, sounds and stuff. Did I see something? But... His perks are really, really interesting. This is sub zero, so we're gonna ignore him. Oh, you poor kittens. <laughs> Do you see how they were both hiding? And that perk just fucking destroyed them. Oh my god. That was beautiful. What the fuck? Okay, I should have held it for a bit longer. The grass has a bit of a cooldown after all. Nice. There you go. Wait, what? I thought. Oh, well, that was an unsafe look. Wow. <laughs> wow. I thought he, he was on my side and he went to the other. And I thought it was the opposite. How cool is that? I'm enjoying this. Let's see if we can do something with barbecue. Oh, he's dead? Wow. Because of lag? No, I don't think so. It was an unsafe pallet. Like, he was fucked. Don't do that. You silly boys. You really have to understand that while you face, you do not see anybody. Like, you could bump into something or have it right in front of you and not see it. You might as well close your eyes while you're facing. Otherwise, you'll, you'll be lulled into a false sense of security, like, oh, there's no one here. You don't want to use the power too much, too. It takes a while to recharge. Okay, that just called out where they are. Hey, guys. Let's torture them a bit. So I'll get a, a mouse one. Recharge my power. How can I see the blood? I don't have the add-on anymore. This thing's glitched as fuck. Oh, that's a bolt. Interesting. I was on the other side of the pile, is what I mean. Oh, really? See, you're kind of like a hillbilly. Oh, no. This man is fucked. Is that the the hunter? Uh, no, the the hags's stun noise. I think so. Jesus, I I had Strider to hear them better, and I still can't fucking figure it out. What the fuck, man? This is difficult. I guess depending on the terrain. I might 
just being yeah <laughs> this is not even worth it I don't think this guy's dead yet it doesn't work oh it does oh they just changed it oh okay it's not that it didn't work it's just that they fucking sucked until now that is oh he went through me man you you saw how I took a little bit of a bump that was me bumping into him you need to react really quickly if that happens well that's nice actually that's much much better sure it doesn't blind you but it's more pleasant I'm gonna pretend I didn't see her. Run. Wait. I have a I have a question. I have a <laughs> That works though. Check this out, huh? So, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna down some zeros. And we're gonna wait. Because we have a perk that lets us, lets us kill him as soon as the generators uh, are done. But will it work if he's already on the ground? what I wonder. Face walk is basically turning into a wraith. Except you're faster. You don't see survivors, so you have to kind of guess where they're gonna go or see their scratch marks. And you can attack them directly out of stealth, which is kind of cool. I guess we might not know right away. He's she's still here. Crunch. My obsession now. I want to see if this is possible because it could make for some really mean plays. What? It's Mardrag. Thank you. Did I read that right? Mardrag. Yes. Thank you so much. Thanks for this from. What? Oh, barely missed. Right. Let's see if they finish the last generator. Hey, it was a prank, bro. I was still here. <laughs> I want them to finish the last generator. I want to see. Where's Sub? There he is. Sub, I'm sorry. You're my guinea pig. You can't do this forever. But... Oh, they're they're failing generators, really. Finish, 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 finish. Come on, finish the last generator. Do it. Do it. Ah. Uh. 
Okay, say that I downed this guy just now. And that they finish the generator. Can we do what I think we can do? I think, I'm pretty sure we can. Hey, what's... You piece of shit! Should have known. He had adrenaline. Your adrenaline is meaningless in the face of your mortality. <laughs> All right. I guess we don't see it. Oh my god. Is that a call that right behind me? You guys, you guys can never fucking leave me have a cinematic kill, can you? She might have fucked up. You thought you were really funny, huh? <laughs> Into the basement you go. Expected more. That's pretty good, considering that it's obviously missing sound effects and stuff. It's not too bad. <laughs> you can attack really fast after after coming back from the ethereal world or whatever. It's really cool. The cooldown though you have to manage it. Not bad guys, not bad. Who's the killer? This is the killer. Adrenaline. I wanted to test something. Uh, well, look at this fucking idiot. I'm gonna kill you all. Uh, this bloody hair brooch I think is pretty good. This says that it stacks, but is there any other item that does the same? Hmm, we'll see. Thank you, Sack Bean. I still I'm not sure what it means because I've only played against her once, so I'm not sure, but Does she turn invisible while she's moving normally? Hmm. Sims, Strat Sims, maybe Strider is not so good, but Predator is a really good standard perk on her. Mm. We'll just beat dickheads now. Damn, can you guys hear the no the kids in the background? They're so noisy. Are they playing right below my fucking window? I'm gonna go shout at them a bit. We need one more. Uh, I'm gonna have to add some of you. Oh my not. I'll be right back. Give me just a second, guys. Are you gonna run Dashes 2 again? Hey, Ectoplasm. Yes. Probably soon. Maybe tomorrow. Right. Shut the window. They're still so fucking loud, man. Go to bed. <sighs> uh, Waterbird, uh, I'll try to clear a spot in my friend list. Give me a second. Hmm. Mm. Do I remove? Hmm. All 
Alright, I'm just removing some random people. Sorry, whoever it is. No hard feelings. That's kind of cool. Uh, it's as a killer for me. It's kind of hard to s to exactly understand my like how I'm tricking them, but I guess it's a good passive ability to have. All right, you guys send me friend requests for the next game. We're gonna have a fucking hex nightmare. So we have predator to track better. Hex ruin, lullaby, and hunt the crown. Oof. Good luck, boys. <laughs> Kale sent me a friend request. Alright, I'll try to catch you guys. Uh, who else did it? Oh god, I hate Steam. Um, incoming requests, okay. So, Nightlands? Is that one of you guys? Kale? Hesto? Uh, one of you I could not, because I still have to remove someone else. Ugh, give me a second. I, to, I just need to remove a bunch of people. What perk has the new survivor? Uh, good question. I'll explain them again. Oh, or not. Okay, so there's a perk that... What is the, what is the first one? I don't remember the first one. So there's one that when he does a save on hooking, it grants him an auto escape from the hook. So say that I unhook my friend safely. I get like a little token. And then if I get hooked for the first time, I can escape by myself, which is fucking crazy, by the way. Uh, at the cost of, you know, being hurt, permanently hurt, as if I had no miter for like uh, 100 seconds. Really, really strong. Then there's another one. Oh yeah, there's one that lets you throw a stone to like uh, make a distraction for the killer. Like you throw a stone and it creates a, a noise. <laughs> it's it's fucking nuts. That's the first one. And the last one um, makes your skill checks for healing um, essentially do more, uh, speed up the process a bit more. Does it work right at the end of the first hook phase? I'm guessing it does. So what you could do, and this is fucking nuts, is literally... Okay, you, you get a save on someone, you get hooked yourself, and you're on comps with your teammates, right? So you tell them not to come, you tell them all to do gents, and then when you're nearly, nearly dead, you can just save yourself. And when you think it's safe, you save yourself. Kind of strong, huh? Right, so we got four totems. We'll see what happens. Right, it's time to ambush somebody. Oh, yeah. I got you. So you saw that that person started running, so I could immediately follow her marks. Okay, that way. There's someone here. Somewhere. Let's hope them. Oh, right there. So we're gonna get two on Hawkins, which is already a really strong lullaby. What are you doing, sub? What are you run after? Really? You guys? Oh, he he unhooked himself. That was. Oh, I guess it was a save on hook. Yeah, this is the perk I was. Nice. 
job. Am I fucking stupid? Did she just fucking disappear? I got you now. Nice. So he can heal himself for a hundred seconds. Good lord. But we're not gonna catch him at this rate. Okay, maybe we will. Right, so this is what happened. Uh, he went for the save, and I allowed a safe save. Bad idea from now on, I guess. So that gave him a token and he could unhook himself on the first hook, but he can't do that anymore. Alright, so they got one of my perks, they got Lullaby, but they still have three tokens, three totems that they have to cleanse. And two of them are traps, so good luck with that, guys. No one on it. On dog! Oh, that's a great idea. Oh my god, these lucky bastards. Stop it, sub. Club deads are gonna be hard to see here. Yeah, I never thought of it. Wow. Doctor with super good tracking, uh, tra uh, tracking early on. They see, they see your. You know what? You know how survivors immediately jump for your tech totems. Now they'll have to think twice. Catch him right over here. He unhooked himself, by the way. Oh my god, this is a new nightmare for killers. Wait, no he didn't. He couldn't have. He got saved. I don't even need to teleport. If you can, it's kind of like the clown. If you can save your power, just save it. You'll have a better chance. Ruin nurses enduring haunted. <sighs> Why did I think anything else would happen? She's over there. All right. Oh my! I sh I should have just let him fucking me. Slug on the ground. Sub Zeroes, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> no offense. Yeah, he's my friend. He's just memeing, but that was so dumb of him. Has the inbuilt kinder taken effect? No, not yet. How did how did they get so lucky? They cleansed two totems and they got my two ruined totems. Who's Arctus, by the way? The Bill. There he is. Okay, we're gonna spook him. Watch this. Boo! We don't wanna hurt him, but we'll waste his time. And now, if we get our power back, we'll rush Sub Zero. Sub Zero's. We don't see scratch marks. Oh! Should have committed. Yeah, you really have. Those were the scratch marks on the way in. Yeah, from the. From the savior. The rescuer, rather. That's good. This is a fun killer to play. Do you have perks? No, no, this is... The, the the killer movement is like the same, I'm guessing, as everything else. Uh, it's her power that makes her go at Chanso-like speed. Okay, he has a comeback for this.
Hey guys. Oh, what the fuck? Gotcha. Second hook. Urban evasion will be a strong perk against her. Nice, Bill. It was hard to see you. I just fucking guessed that you would be there. I don't want to kill him. Hmm, this is much better. Now, sub Zero has adrenaline. If we could get rid of him, I wouldn't complain. Nice. Incredible blade to make against that invisible fucking enemy. <laughs> oh, nice, you started running. Remember, you stop seeing them immediately after you start charging. So, you're gonna have to anticipate. The moment you see her stop as a survivor, you need to start being really unpredictable. Got stuck. This is your corner now. Uh, absolutely dishonorable. Well done. Hi, Odds. Hi, Micro. Welcome. We'll give them another chance. How they do? I can be faster than them. Jesus Christ! All right. Run the Valor Hope with Gaunt Hunter Crown. That'll be good. Maybe I should have run that instead of uh, what's what's the name? Um, Lullaby. Or something. Not just right here. Could we grab? Oh my god, that would be a fun play, huh? Grab him right out of invisibility? Kind of like a uh, like a nurse that grabs us right after a teleport. It's really hard. You can't you can't phase for very long. This this power is so simple, yet so difficult to master. I imagine. What's this killer? She can turn invisible, but then she also doesn't see survivors, and she becomes really fast. Check it out. So while I'm in this creepy, creepy mode, 
I'm invisible. I make a little bit of sound, apparently. And I can't see them or their blood. But I can't see their scratch marks. So... It's kinda cool. Oh yeah, I just got a fucking sword or something. Arcturus, my boy. <laughs> Where the fuck are you? I know we're gonna find him. He's green as fuck. Seriously, man. <laughs> what are you? So you can hit a survivor. You can hit a survivor and catch up to them really fast. This is what she looks like. Look at her movement too, and her limbs. See how they're separated from her body? My heart. <laughs> I spook Archer so much when he was by that tree. Might be worse as usual. Uh, gents, that will most likely be tomorrow. Or the next stream, which, yeah, probably tomorrow. Hell, man. Fuck is that? <laughs> this is the new killer. Alright, hand to ground. I love this thing. I still haven't gotten to use it. Which makes me kind of sad, but... Alright. Alright. This is okay. You the door accidentally. Can't even count this high. Paragon. Day one supporter. Day two lover. Day three things that I can't say on stream without getting banned. Can we try a killer in Laris? In Laris? <laughs> I mean, we could, but am I not gonna be super fucked? This killer- this killer's kinda like the nurse. She needs a big open- open space. She can't do fucking anything in a super close map. Although, maybe I'll hear- Maybe I'll hear- Generators or something. What are her perks? I'll go over them real quick. So, her perks. Let me select them all. Haunted Ground. It makes uh, two hex totems appear and they're actually traps. If somebody cleanses them, <laughs> and somebody will, trust me, they always do. Uh, except in this fucking games, because these fuckers are lucky. Uh, every survivor gets exposed, which means we can shot- we can one- one shot- uh, one- one hit down them. For 60 seconds. Big deal. <laughs> uh, next perk is Spirit Fury. It's a pallet breaking perk. Kinda cool. Every time you- br you break a pallet, you get tokens when you break two of them. The next pallet stun breaks the totem, so you can, like, chase them through pallets. I don't know about you, but I'm kind of excited about that one. Uh, I'm gonna play with her perks with a different killer. If they're not watching the stream, this might take them by surprise. Cock- Oh! Yeah, I'm gonna use the ultra rare one. Alright, so we're gonna use... We're gonna use... <laughs> Save the best for last. Rancor, and then the other two perks that are Spirit, and we'll run Enduring to challenge every fuck. Nah, I'm, uh, I'm gonna change my mind on these two. I'm gonna go for Nurses and the Bamboozle. <laughs> this is cool as fuck, man. Why not? Let's give them a spook. Cox Compass Ghosts. That's what I, I'm running, right? <laughs> but don't go into treatment mode until they cleanse it. 
That is so fucking evil. Holy shit. I never even thought of it. The treatment mode, that's right. So, Doctor, if you're not aware, when he goes into treatment mode, as, pretty much as soon as he comes into contact with survivors, he makes them scream once, and then never again until he does more stuff. But that first thing is kind of, it's kind of meaningful. <laughs> oh god. Which one is Rancor? No, Rancor is the one that makes you have an obsession and be able to straight up murder them at the end of the game. <laughs> uh, it's Spirit Fury, the one with the pallets. That's the one we're running. Thrill of the Hunt and Ruin. Why Thrill of the Hunt? Yeah, what's... what's Oh, to slow them down? Jesus. Yeah, you could have Thrill of the Hunt, Ruin, Rancor, and then, you know, <laughs> Lullaby or some shit for good measure. Or, you know, uh, what's the other one? Uh... I messed up? It's completely silent. What the fuck? <laughs> that is so fucking OP. Uh, not really, but that's so nice. Oh my god, this makes him so much scarier. <laughs> I'm gonna slug them. They could have. I'm here, bitch. I thought he would go for it. He's getting hit still. <laughs> I love this. She didn't go for the pallet for some reason. Wait, they're already healed from zero? They had an insta heal, huh? Maybe I should have brought the other perk. Uh, knockout. There's someone here. There was someone here. The crowds were disturbed. Let's see if we find them. That wasn't very good. Oh, there they are. Though. And they don't hear this. That's the best part. <laughs> nice try. Nice. Let's find this person. We'll take a roundabout way. There she is. <laughs> she misses Kilchuk. I, I messed up. I could have approached her better. Right here. We need to injure more of them. If we stand still, we're completely invisible. I'm digging this invisible business. He does have a... Do you see that little speed boost? He does have a built-in windstorm, it's nice. Oh, 
It's really... What? Okay. Wait! Wait! Right! The pallet thingy! Oh, fuck, you're an idiot. <laughs> but I'm even a bigger idiot. That's so unpleasant. Challenge this. And check it out. Ah, oh, we she dropped it earlier. God damn it. <sighs> what the fuck are you doing? So there you go. That's really cool, huh? That's what I wanted to do. I love that. Good animation, too. That's really nice. Hi, Barry. Welcome. Yeah, for killers like this one? It means that every three pallets, you get a free fucking attack, basically. Oh, we got someone. They got spooked a bit. That's gonna and that's gonna make a difference, Sub Zeros, you piece of shit. Alright, let's get more stacks. What are you guys doing? Uh, he's uh he's half dead already. Please drop another pallet. Oh my god! <laughs> Check it out! <laughs> What's wrong, Bill? What's wrong? Go through! Come on! Go through! <laughs> this map... Yeah, that, 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 that is not supposed to happen. He got fucking picked up. <laughs> <laughs> That's not supposed to be close. What the fuck? Ooh, it's almost enough to catch him at the end of a sprint burst. Hi, right. shit. Uh, wrong button. <laughs> I meant to press space. Don't mind me. Oh my god! Look at why is there a fucking <laughs> what? Let's see what else is happening here. Is there anything unusual in the basement? No. Why is there a fucking chair, uh, like a like a hospital bed right there? <laughs> All right. I guess no one can go through now. Oh wow, it's it's legitimately a fucking cool de sac. Hello. Hmm, that is beautiful. Oh please, please run into it. Yes. Oh, that would have made my day. <laughs> oh, you piece of shit. How amazing is that? They think they're safe at a pallet and every third pallet you just destroy them. Enduring just... With combina a combination of this and Enduring will be so nice on like the Trapper, the Clown... Oof. Are these custom games? Yes, because I'm rank 1 and I can't like can't find a fucking normal game. This little... This little windstorm that you get by default is kinda nice now, by the way. Why, why am I hooking? Uh oh, you messed up. <laughs> I blocked the pallet for him. Okay, I guess I'll hook everybody now. Ah, 
I was gonna slog everybody. But... This works too. Alright, you stupid idiot. You're gonna f run out of your flashlight eventually. Oh my god. You never run out of the flashlight. That is so stupid. <laughs> Wait, you can't go through here. That's right. Can't spook her. Oh, how is she seeing us? In ev in any other map, this would actually be stronger. Like the okay, the the seeing through walls is stronger in this map, but the surprise thing, it's kind of nice. Fly Friday the Thirteenth. Oh man, that game is starting to die now, isn't it? Developers kind of give up on it. Last I heard. Sub will be close over here. Hello? He hasn't seen me. Oh, he has. Look at that fucking fast as fuck spring burst. Nice. You will not make it. They get that little vacuum, that slight vacuum. It throws you off. I should have known. Perfect. Alright, so we get another token. Killer looks dope. She's incredible. She's really fun. Probably will get really hard to use, but it's kind of like the clown. If you don't know how to use her power, just play normal killer. Just chase normal. I'm guessing she has like normal stats. Okay, we have some spooking potential. How? How do they know I'm here? That guy finished healing. If you catch him, he's dead. Right. Let's try and catch him. Bamboozle! Back to sub zeros. There we go. Right on time. Now we chase this person and we make it back. Now sub zeros has to essentially heal up again from scratch. <laughs> you cowards. Come back. Ah. Uh, but they're on comms, so yeah, they're gonna be able to tell each other. Okay, then. Shit, sub is, is like nearly oh. dead from slugging. I'm sure they've opened a gate by now or something. Time to the bing bong. He got a bit of an upgrade. He's probably gonna be a lot more fun to play now. 
We're using one of his ultra rares, which makes his uncloaking completely silent. How cool is that? What? There you go. Epic Gamer Moments. That must be the most beautiful username on Twitch at the minute. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime. What an epic gamer moment. Also, check out this other epic gamer moment. When two fucking rooms spawn on the same fucking quadrant. And there's a fucking bed here that's not supposed to be. Hmm. Okay. Can you play the new killer? Yeah, we'll play her again. Customer support. Okay. Look at that insta heal that they used immediately. Locker jokes easy. Yeah, of course. Thick shame me too much. <laughs> that was a very unusual thing. Alright, let's play the negative killer again. Is there really a bing bong? Is there no bing or nor bong to be heard? I know, right? It, it does betray his nature a bit. I'll give you that much. Guys, if there's more people that want to join, please send me friend requests on Steam. And if you guys have played a bit, maybe leave so they have a chance. Uh, the spirit this is the new killer. Let's go for some interesting perks. Let's see. So, nurses, obviously it's good. Fuck, it's really good, but it's no, it's no, it's not cheating. Cause when you go into her power, everything becomes invisible, even auras. So you can't abuse it, unfortunately. <laughs> Otherwise, it would be fucking crazy. But still, to find people, I guess it's good. I could try it. Uh, my personal favorite, the one that seems to work for me, and I guess I recommend it, is Predator. Predator seems to be like a good perk for her, because you really need to see those scratch marks really well. That's a good standard perk. Uh, barbecue and pop. Where's pop? Pop goes the least. So Spare of Fury is like a better bamboozle, it's really nice. I think I'll put it on. I like this. Thank you, Knight. That's great. Okay, that works. Bye if you Knight. Take care. Uh, Soygoy, you're not supposed to see blood. If you are seeing blood, that's gotta be a glitch of some kind. There's an ultra rare for her that lets you see blood. But I'm not using it right now, so I shouldn't see any. But yeah, with Sloppy Butcher, it could be... It could be a really good way to track them. Even if they crouch, you would still track them, which is a big deal. You don't see any new blood, but you still see the old blood. What? That makes sense. Praying Mantids, you're back at it. Thank you. Thank you for the random gifted subs. Oh, fuck this map, right. Uh, Strato, Abel Tomato, what? and Raven, please, guys, do enjoy it. And send Praying Mantids uh, a thank you message if you're grateful. All right. What? Yep, that's the last one. Thank you so much. So, yeah, this is probably, like, the worst map for this killer. Just kind of think of her like a hillbilly of sorts. See? I could, like... You also don't hear... Found one. Okay, so I'm getting my power back, and I'm gonna use it. So, as soon as it's back, we'll use it and catch up to sub. Oh, no, he's an idiot. <laughs> Alright, he's got Decisive, and that's completely fine. This killer is a good counter to Decisive. Check it out. Oh, he didn't hit it. <laughs> well, if they miss it, then it's even better. Okay. Let's use barbecue and close in on someone. Okay, you see that gen right over there? We're gonna make our way to it as fast as we humanly can. 
That is really fast movement. A hillbilly wouldn't be able to do this. Not in this map. I see him. We're gonna catch up to him. Check it out. We can't see him, but we can he's we can see his scratch on the ground. Next pallet he gets to, we'll break it immediately. We don't have enduring fair enough, but it should still be pretty good. Am I stupid? There we go. Found him. That was fun. Remember, if this guy... If this guy stops running, I don't see... I wouldn't have a meaningful way of tracking him. I didn't use my run very well. He dropped the pallet here somewhere, didn't he? Let's break it. Actually, no. Let's not break it. Let's make use of it. Uh, later. Let's go for this gen right away. Gotcha! So this is the equivalent of a nurse landing her blink. You guessing where they are. Or figuring it out by the ground. What? Am I stupid? Did, did he run past me? I'm onto you. There you go. Basement's here. We'll put him in. Make your choice is a mean fucking perk for this character, by the way. It's gonna be really strong. Run around, touch some toes, some gens, whatever. And when they go for the rescue, use your power, close in on them, bam. Okay, you see that one over there? We're gonna go try to go for that one. Mm, too late. Oh well. I see her. Was that two of them? Oh, what's gonna. Oh. Sup? Nice. And the thing is immediately destroyed, thanks to our perk. Isn't that nice? <laughs> Look at that. Look at that, he's fucking powerless. Gotcha. I had no fucking clue where he was. But he didn't either. He's, she saved it. Okay. Alright, let's do it. There she is. That's really good. You will never catch up. Without enduring, you will never catch up to a survivor who just decides if you that fast with any other killer or than like nurse maybe. Alright, let's use Oh, yeah, that was my mistake. You don't charge the power immediately after doing that. Because if you do, you stop seeing, you stop seeing RS, so barbecue is kind of useless. You greedy bastards. Come on! I, I, I saw the grabbing animation! Ugh. I'll make them regret this. I would have used Pop My Weasel. I would have used the Pop the Weasel perk. Jesus. Alright, well that's what, three hits? Fair enough. We're gonna see if I can catch up on. Let's use barbecue. Oh, you see that person healing? Let's see if we can find her. There she is. Nice. Easy nurse and a slow wraith. Hmm. Yeah, 
But she's not easy, man. She's not easy. If your survivors play you well, how the fuck do you ever guess where they're gonna be if they use, you know, urban evasion and stuff? Yeah, no, it's difficult. This is why I saved this pallet, so I could use that token now. Now I only need another pallet until we activate our Spirit Fury again. I'm gonna use this to camp. Didn't work. Oh well. Oh. See that? Oh, I can't use my power yet. But she's right here. Somewhere. Gotcha. Now he'll drop that pallet. We'll break it. And now we have the... The Spirit Fury thing ready. Arctus, what are you doing? <laughs> okay. No, neither. Yeah, I thought of that. But remember, she can't really see blood when she's in the spirit. Only when she's not. Can a man get some privacy? Stop typing in the chat, you numbskull. You are so loud. Oh, you're dead. Who's that, man? So remember, they were all like walking, which means that if I tell if I'm in the face world and I go around them, I wouldn't see them. They wouldn't leave any scratch marks. You can still hear, so you could hear them like heal and stuff, but you make so much noise, you hear like a big whoosh. So you can't hear very well. Strider could be useful, but I found I found it hard so far. This map wasn't so bad. I thought it would be terrible. Oh, oh wow, you were right here. Springburst, right? Oh, go for it. Check it out again. We're gonna. She's gonna drop this pallet on us, and we're gonna be able to. No, he knows. Now he knows to drop it early. Well done. Yeah, sub, sub already knows how to counter this bird. He's gonna, he's gonna drop it early. Now he's gonna get hit. No, he's not even gonna drop it. Oh. He knows that if he drops it on my face now, I'm ready, and that uh, the, the pallet will break. That's one of the things that. Burst, nice. Okay, let's go for the. What the fuck? Let's find sub. There you are. Dropping it early. Now nah, you made a mistake. Now nah, you made a mistake. You're fucked. It's gonna be a mind game. Now nah, you're fucked. You're you're so fucked. <laughs> she was like, fuck. Her power's recharging. Okay. An anime protagonist. Um. So, it's basically a nurse that doesn't face through things. And kind of like the nurse, while you teleport, you don't see anything. You don't actually see survivors. See? They disappear. And you're really fast, kind of like a hillbilly. So, you need to... It's, more, it's not like the hillbilly, it's more like, a, it's more like a big sprint. So, you have to guess where they are, or where they'll be. And then, stop facing and find them. When you face, you leave a body behind. Cool, huh? That's what this killer looks like. Along with Doctor, you're probably the only killer that can stare at himself. Hey guys. So once they start running, Predict where they're gonna go, and hit them like that. They can hear you, but they can't really see you. You're completely invisible. As far as I think, as far as I know. That's some loot body. Yeah, it, I, I think the design is quite cool. The way her limbs are made and all, it's kinda, it's kinda cool. Uh, let's see if we can catch up to this mark. You see how we're catching up? Let's, let's see if we can catch up farther.
he stopped running they did well wait hmm. all right let's rush back to the hook Interesting. This is gonna be interesting to play against. But it's very, very fun to play as. I'll tell you that much. Oh, I think Knight lands. He's dead on hook. He might just let his partner die. That little whoosh lets us know. There they are. Did I get completely fucking dodged? Okay, I see this played up. We'll catch one in this corner. There she is. As soon as our power is back, we'll catch up really fast. This is the blood that was already on the ground, but now we don't see any new blood. But she's right here. There we go. Nope. <laughs> I love the way they I love the way she picks them up. That's really fun. Better than that, that grab uh, allowed us not to drop her to the ground. So the last guy doesn't know where we are. Oh, please let me hook her. Mm. Okay. Damn. Yeah, we, we would have had a bit of an advantage there. We could have used barbecue to find the last person. We're not gonna slug them. It would be nice. Oh, I think I saw him. So I'm using my power now as a hailbilly chainsaw. Yup, he just, he's right there. Oh, he had the hatch right there. GG. Really cool killer to play. Not so sure how fun it is to play against her. I love Dance With Me. Dance With Me, oh, nice one. I guess he lost me a bunch of times. GG, oh, Dance With Me. A perk that leaves no... and lightweight. I guess. Yeah, this killer is actually amazing. He's... She's, she's single-handedly making many perks that were kind of rare, obscure, and not so useful. Kind of nice. But then again, you don't know what you're gonna play against her, so... Just look at her limbs. Her, her left forearm in particular. Look how the fucking chunks of meat just move and stuff. Look at look at her elbow. It's crazy. Random maps? Yeah, we'll do random maps. Hello, eaters. Oh, you wanna do your thing? I'm sorry, man. We're gonna be going for a bit longer. Not a lot longer, but we'll be going for a bit longer. Okay. Yeah, let's do random maps. I don't this is a really difficult add-on to understand like you don't understand I don't understand how effective it is what what perks does she start with we'll go over them again sure um the first one is haunted ground it's a trap hex totem. It's two of them. If they touch any two of them, uh, they all get exposed. So yeah, you just have to leave it alone. Kind of cool. The other one is Rancor. You have an obsession and you can immediately down them and immediately kill them at the end of the game. But all throughout the game, the obsession can see you every time they do a gen. And then... Uh, a very interesting one, Spirit Fury. Every time you break a number of pallets, in this case two, 
the next pallet that you get stunned by, you get stunned by, it will immediately just, um, it will immediately uh, break on contact, which with enduring is really nice. <laughs> Damn, Locker Jukes with Dance With Me was good, right, Ots? Uh, I didn't even fucking notice it, man. It's really hard. When you're playing uh, the Spirit, it's really hard to know what's going on, so... It's kind of like when you play Peg and you crouch and people are around you and you don't see them. Your senses are very, very limited. You have to play around it. Hey, Kid Bora, welcome. Welcome back. Huh. I'm gonna try to play the meanest... Maybe not the meanest, but a pretty mean fucking... Build, let's see what happens. We need one more. Uh, I'm sorry, that's annoying. I'll invite some people. Not sure who will want to join, but right. Of course, this kind of defeats the point if they already know what I'm fucking bringing, but still kind of cool. That'll be good. Well, I'm not gonna ready up. Send a few invites. If anybody wants to join, go ahead. Will you be playing any other games on today's stream? I'm not sure. We might take a break or something and then play something else. We are this in the killer, and unfortunately it doesn't seem like we can play public matches. But we'll give it another we'll give it another shot later. I can't join. Invite me. Do I have you in my friend list, my dude? Hmm. I don't have you added. I'm gonna remove some friends. Really? This this new Steam thing is kind of weird. Uh, Kid Bora, I am working on a PUBG video right now. You guys want to see a little? You want to see a preview of it? And it's it's really close to being finished, so yeah. In the very near future, I will. After that, I don't know if I'll make another one for a while, but... Maybe I will. Do you make like that perks makes Brutal not as good now? A brutal is still useful for kicking gens and pallets. So... No, I, I would say it's still alright. It's... You probably will have... It's kind of like uh, Rancor and... What's the word? A uh, bit of murmur. You probably don't want to run both of them because they kind of overlap. So yeah, maybe. But if you want to be a fucking power destroyer, run enduring brutal, and then <laughs> the other one, uh, spirit fury, and then no fucking pilots anywhere. No one in chat wants to join. I'm pretty sure they do, but this is a bit. I'm gonna accept more people on my friend list, and then when I accept you as a friend, you guys can join directly. <sighs> Let's see. Has anybody sent me a friend of course? Kale. Uh, is there anybody else to send me one? I mean Maria's seen tears. You like you like this new video. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you wanna see the alright. Hey, Kale is here. Alright, I guess we can go with this. I'll prepare a little preview for you guys. Hound the ground again? Yeah, I'll read it. So, Hound the Ground. Two trap hex totems will spawn in the trial. When one of them the, when one of them gets cleansed, 
the other one disappears or bec becomes normal. And every survivor, it's like a trap. When somebody triggers the trap, every survivor gets exposed for 40 seconds, 60 seconds at max level. So it's like a temporary noid at the start of the game if they touch your totem. Really nice. How are people going to do ruin with haunted or active? They can't. They have to take a. They have to take a big fucking gamble. So there's three. There's three fucking totems, and one of them is ruin, and the other one's the trap. So <laughs> good fucking luck. How do I know it's your actual account and not someone else's? Uh, look at my. Look at my alternate names. One of them is Oliver the Collector from a video I made like three years ago. A banshee. I, I'm not sure about the terminology. Yeah, she's kind of cool, and I'm I'm sure her skins will be fucking incredible. Anyway, uh, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, the preview. I'll I'll show you something. That's going to be disgusting. Well, not really, because if you cleanse Ruin, you get lucky. He's already wasted two perks for the rest of the game, right? But yep, yep. No way. Fungus, I didn't know you were streaming. Thank you so much for the host. Uh, you guys, many of you that don't watch me play Dead by Daylight often, you wouldn't know, but Fungus is a really fun streamer. He <laughs> he rated me once before, and I didn't fucking notice it like a fucking idiot, but I'm so happy he did, because I checked him out afterwards. And he might be my favorite streamer of the moment. It's so much fucking fun to watch him. He's very educational, and he knows this game inside out. I guess he's been playing uh, the new killer for a while. Uh, Jay, have you been playing this? What do you think of it? Hello, mate. <laughs> hey, Fungus, welcome. And the little fan family. It will make people afraid to touch totems, maybe. Yeah, it will. I think it's great. Uh, maybe it will be frustrating. We'll, we'll see. A huge skill gap, and I love it. I know, right? Find them and guessing. I, I, uh, I kind of agree. It's going to be fun. I'm gonna run a really mean fucking bill with it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I'm playing with my friends, by the way, because I didn't, I, I couldn't find anybody in lobbies. I was like rank one. Look at, there's like four totems. <laughs> hey guys. What the fuck are you doing? Oh well. So now we hit her once. Oh, they got rid of one of my perks. That's so sad. Nice. I used my power poorly there. Gotcha. <laughs> you can still hear. All right. So this is where the game's gonna begin for real. We're gonna put her on a corner. <laughs> this isn't this isn't perfect, but fair enough. <laughs> we would want to hook her somewhere with like no pallets left. All right, he didn't go here, so we're we're gonna assume he's going for the safe. As soon as we get the power bag, we'll try to make a play. Touch my totem right here. What? You shameless bastards. Oh! They're exposed! They trigger the trap! Oh, this is the first time this ever happens! Oh, my power's not here. Please get it back. Get it back faster. Yes, yes. Oh, it's a field day! One down. And I'm gonna find the other one. You sorry fools. Gotcha. Haha. <laughs> I saw the fucking grass. Hang on. Can I get the final one? Yes, I can. She's going for the save right now. If I get my power back, I might be able to outspeed her. Maybe. <gasps> I still have 15 seconds. Quick, 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 quickly. Very fast, very fast, very fast, very fast. Very, 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 very fast. All right. We need to hit this cloud dead. There's a window there. She's going to go for it. No. Oh, she messed up. Oh. Oh my god, look! Oh, okay, my, my perk run out right on time. 
very lucky over. Otherwise, she would have been down, and then I would have been straight for the final, uh, for the final survivor. They were lucky. All right, let's try to mine game. What? Oh, okay. Good job. I almost got the game. Yeah. Jesus. What? She went through me. <laughs> no! That's so difficult to manage. Damn. I had them all here. I didn't really capitalize on it very much. Alright. Well. Predator is a nice perk, but... Let's... Let's... Let's go for... Our strategy here. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Wow. I didn't realize. That perk is the new meta, 100%. With ruin and it destroys survivors. Holy shit! What were they thinking? What were they? Th that is, that is crazy strong. You saw how I could almost down all of them. Imagine I had a nurse or something. <laughs> Good fucking grief! Right, let's try to do this. I'm gonna show you... Okay, we need to just get away for like 32 minutes. 32 minutes is like this. We can literally just wait right here. Um, let, me, let me try to prove a point. We did it earlier and it was fucking filthy. Maybe he's calling them out. Yeah, he's probably calling it out. It's okay. We'll be right here. So. Make your choice. It's coming. Make your choice. On this character. Immediately down. Nothing he can do. Other than try to like. Be unpredictable. <laughs> they got my ruin finally. And that wasn't even. This, is, this, was, this was a pretty. Like, it wasn't a really corralled area, uh, corralled area where I could, like, uh, immediately get the... This grass is so nice! Okay, I thought it was, I thought it was gonna play some kind of mind game. Huh, let me get my power back. He's right there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get him. I knew you would be here. That's just playing dirty. It is very dirty. You put a spin out on on this thing. Oh, and I'm gonna get them in the basement. Basic, pretty much dead. She can get so quickly in and out of a uh, place. She's got the, the little um, cooldown for sure. But that is- they cannot get out of there. So long as I stay anywhere near here. The person that goes for the rescue is, is pretty much is pretty much dead. I'll try to show you. Wait, I saw grass move here. Oh, I mean not. I could literally wait right here. You can use your clone as a body block. No way. No way. You can do that? <laughs> I didn't know. Oh, that's filthy. I guess in a map like like what? Oh no, that's not the that's not the hags. That's the nurses' uh, sound effect.
<laughs> nice one. He has way. Told you, high skill gap. Oh, that is amazing. How do you figure that out? I guess in a map like the game or... What's a map with... You could... So you, you're telling me that if I wanted to... I could... Trap this... Kind of like a bamboozle of sorts and then... Come get someone like that? Wow. Wow. Oh, oh. Hi, Bill. Nice bait, horrible execution. Rip. What? Am I playing just now? I don't know what I was doing. <laughs> okay. Teleporting into a high vantage point? Seems like a good strat too. With any other killer, you go up, they see you get up there, and then they hide. With this killer, you can go up there and then do your thing. Alright, let's see if... Oh. I can't really water block her anywhere, can I? Oh, where did you go? I want to I wanna test this body blocking, but maybe I'm just not very creative right now. Hello all. Hi, Patches. Alright, we'll give him a break. The chick that dropped the pallet. Oh. Yeah, that was who? Sub. Rip sub. Oh. Uh. I let them pick themselves up. Where are you guys? Oh, he heal himself first. Have you found have you found out any other good tricks? Uh, and have you tested the predator on this thing? I like predator on it. Oh, hi, found you. You can also do some cheeky camping, like you put someone on a hook. And if you're confident that someone's gonna come, you can literally just wait like this. And then do that. It's a bit of a gamble though, but... It's like ghost camping. <laughs> Kinda cool, huh? Oh! Can we block him here somewhere? Okay, you know you block him, but you don't know you can't see him being blocked. So he's right. It it really is about. You get inside one of these cows. <laughs> oh. All right, good game, you guys. I've tested almost everything. I was running surveillance and pulling people off gents very often. No way. <laughs> You found a way to make surveillance useful? You might just you might just <laughs> deserve the next fucking Nobel Prize. That is incredible. Uh I so one of my viewers figured out that uh, what's the name of it? Mm, uh, Dance with me is a good counter. To get out of a locker or, you know, a bolt and then lose your your marks. Nurses, monitor, make your choice. And devour hope or surveillance. Surveillance, man! That is nuts! Uh, do you have any idea of on, on, on what the no the noises she makes is, are like? Because I, I, since I haven't played Survivor against her, I really have no clue. But man, uh, props to you for figuring out so much. Oh, GG. Uh, see, this guy, he has been playing this for almost as long, sorry, for probably a bit longer than me, but maybe an hour longer. He had an hour of a head start, he's already figured out so much. I do recommend checking out his streams so much. If you like Dead by Daylight, please do yourself a favor and give him a follow. <laughs> Hang on. Iron Will and Spine Chill. Ooh, that's filthy. Hang on.
yeah, the thing that I noticed is that you stop seeing, as soon as you start charging, you stop seeing survivors. So that's when they have to start to make their play. I wonder what a really good spirit will be like. Huh. Great game. Look at all these multicolored GGs. I'm proud of you guys. Okay. Nurses monitor, make your choice. I tested nurses. I guess it's nice, but it would be nicer if you could if you could see them while you're in the spirit world. That would be nice. Uh Kid Bora. Uh, even though the game is usually over by that point, there is a perk that they can use that lets them pick themselves up. There's also the chance that, you know, I might not have a hook somewhere near and they could escape me. Or they could have decisive and also escape my grass. So yeah, it's not over. Sometimes sometimes they can pick themselves up and do stuff. The link for... Yeah, I don't think... Uh, Fungus might be making a YouTube channel soon. Or maybe he has one, you know, is investing time just now into it. So yeah, the link for his YouTube probably doesn't work. But he's, he's, ma he's mainly a Twitch guy. Dude, do check out his Twitch. He's really, really great. And as he always says, he streams at different times than me, so you don't have to cheat on me to watch him, which is also amazing. The new replacement to well make it for survivors is insane. I have a YouTube channel, but it's small at the moment. Gotta get more videos up soon. Do let me know if I can ever help you with videos, Fangus. Best of luck in that department. Oh, man. Alright, you guys wanna go killer? I'll go survivor. This is the new survivor, by the way. Looks really cool. Hmm. I'll play. I'll play Fangman. You guys can. One of you guys can go kill her. Let's try some of these new perks. <laughs> I want to try this one. <laughs> what is this diversion perk? <laughs> what the fuck? All right, we, we, yeah, we'll, we'll see what the fuck is up with this. So it seems like both survivors and killers got a new meta perk, and I don't know which one is more disgusting. <laughs> Go Dwight. I'm not going Dwight. <laughs> you can help me with videos odds. Need all the help I can get. Yeah, the thing that... Uh, I'm not even doubting that you're an amazing editor and obviously a good content creator. But YouTube is a bit... It's not very straightforward sometimes. You wouldn't understand why is my video doing poorly? Why is it doing well all of a sudden? And, you know, I have a few years of uh, trial and error, so... We could have a talk someday about it if you wish. Okay. Which is gonna be the last perk? I will just run a normal self-care or something. Alright. Yeah, one of you can be the killer, but now they're both of you. So, please. <laughs> That high with that hook thing is insane. Ooh! I didn't even think of it. Oh, uh, sure. Where's that heart? Where's that heart? There it is. Right. <laughs> wow. Wow. The, ni the, the, the thing, I guess, that counters deliverance, I guess, it's like a high risk, high reward. Because if you get hooked first, then you're it's completely useless, right? And if the killer is a camping asshole, which apparently now he has more reason to be, then you also kind of lose it. Or you don't get it, rather. <laughs> Alright, this will be interesting. Oh, it's a die die die. What do, what do you make of this perk, uh, Fungus? Is it just super niche and super useless? Oh, wait! It's level 3, now you get more tokens. Oh, I, I, I didn't read the... Oh, wait. Hmm. Maybe we should run it.
It's crazy at five stacks. I healed Bill in 20 seconds with it. 20 seconds is... 20 seconds is too long. What? Really? I was only at three when I healed him with it. Uh, okay. I think we're ready. Oh. I think we're... I think we're... I think we'll be ready soon. There we go. It's pretty cool. Wow, man. The, the killer's job is gonna be so fucking- There's so many perks now, man. Oh, man. Do you see my Steam request? Alabaster. Yeah, tell me what your name is. Alaba Harris? Is that you? It's gotta be, isn't it? I think I accepted you. Yep. Alright. Already up, guys. Oh. Oh, Darkest Moonlight. Yeah, I see you. Sorry, someone has a... Ah, uh, I got out you fucking hell. Give me a sec. I need to remove someone else. And this is making it kind of difficult. Uh, when I have a minute, I'll go on my friend list and... And remove like 20 million people. All right, guys, you need to ready up. We'll see how Arctus does this. Let's see if I can out someone again. All right, Darkest Moonlight. Shouldn't be my friend list now. There you go. Ready button, it's gone. <laughs> can we not play Survivor? I might send you all off and I'll just play Survivor by myself, but are there any new cosmetics? I don't think so. We had some new ones really soon, pretty, I mean, pretty recently. It went through, thanks. Oh, you're welcome. I don't think they put any cosmetics in the speed TV. Alright, what's going on? Artrix, can you be killer? Should I rejoin? Yeah. Or. Leave and let someone else join. Okay. There you go. There are several new cosmetics packs leaked. Really? I want to see them. <laughs> That's. I don't mind being spoiled on that. I want to see that. Alright guys, if you've been here for a while, please leave. Please leave. Please clap. So the, the new people can play. It did it again. Well, Arctus, maybe you're not meant to be killer. Let's see if somebody else can do it. But one of you guys is gonna have to go spectate or, yeah, or go away. Can't wait to see any new skins. Come on! I beg you! Arjus, you've been playing for a while. There you go. Oh, some- who left? Oh, oh, alright. What? Alright, can we ready up? Cannot start with zero killers. Excuse me? Oh, I guess you guys don't fucking count. Oh wow, now it happens to me as well. <laughs> Jesus. Oh fuck, now it's gone for good. Alright guys, if, if this happens, you guys need to fucking leave. What? We'll, we'll do it one more time. The Monica's. Good night, guys. Good night. Is it the hello good night or the goodbye good night? Welcome. Just beat up. Welcome. 
It's a bug. It seems like if it happens, it just stays there. Ooh, is that ghost booty? My goodness. Ooh, scary. Skill defense. Alright, I'm inviting some of you. Oh, you guys just join off. It's a hello. Demonicus, yeah. In some languages saying good night, it's like a hey, have a good night. Uh, not the goodbye. It's like it's like saying good morning. I saw the trapper became Terminator. Clown looks old and Nia is a ninja. The fuck? Alright. Oh, I lost all my stuff. I'll try this new perks, alright. What the fuck? Okay. I see the issue. So when you switch from anything to anything, it disappears and doesn't come back. Alright guys, I'm sorry, I just wanted to play Survivor with you fuckers, but... Doesn't seem like it's gonna be possible. We're gonna try to play a game of killer. See if by now we get anybody. Enjoy, have fun in the PTB. Thank you. I don't know if I'll be play if I'll be able to play with random people. How do you even manage it? Because you must be ranked one in both. And you live in Australia. Where I guess there's less people than Europe. Especially this time. How did she manage to get games? I'm gonna hop out. Thanks for the games. Bye, Slayer. AK Jon Snow. Sleep tight. Can you guys hear that? Yeah. No, what the f Honest, honestly, one of you guys invited me to trade accidentally, and now I have a notification that just he's inviting you to trade. All right, thanks, team. How's the new killer? Hi, the Kyos. It's yeah, it's a new killer, and it's it's hell fun. Unfortunately, uh, doesn't seem like we can play as it in public games. We played a bunch on private ones. Let's play some more as a survivor, I guess. I did that on accident. I don't blame you, man, but Steam is fucking stupid. Now I can't get rid of it. There you go. Now it's gone. Thank God. Hmm. Oh. Alright. I guess I'm playing with my buddies. Damn, we can't try these new perks. If you guys don't ready up in like two fucking seconds, I swear to god. I'm gonna kill all of you. Thank you. What is the new killer's gimmick? She can become invisible. And wander around, kind of like the Wraith. Really, really fast. Much faster than the Wraith for a limited time. She doesn't see survivors, but she can immediately face out an attack. So essentially you have to you become blind, you don't see survivors, but you have you can chase them by following their scratch marks and then boom. All right, now let's see. I'll open the key, I guess.
All right, let's go. It's time to try and how to play. <laughs> what they want to die? Should I create it as a killer so you can play a survivor? Yeah, that could have worked, actress. But then again, is your connection stable enough? We'll be run into trouble. That's a good alternative. Jesus Christ. You're level 102. Yeah. I'm actually level 120, but, you know, I lost progress because the PTB takes your information from, like, a few weeks back or something. How does you play? Hi, sub. Yeah, good meme. Hmm. I hope it's the new killer. <laughs> it would be really lame if he's playing fucking hillbilly now or something. Did they patch the, did they pass the wraith? Yeah, yeah, they did. On top of all these changes uh, on the Wraith, there's the new killer. Can you play normal games? Uh, as a survivor, yes. Because of rank, I guess. As a killer, no. Because of rank, I guess. Uh, luckily, I could play with you guys. Thank God, otherwise I would have been so disappointed. I really wanted to play the new killer. Okay. Streetwise, we got a Nia. Oh, no. Oh, he used a shroud of whatever the fuck. Oh, oh. Hey, guys. What happens if I touch this? You guys want me to touch this? I think I should touch this. I think something good will happen if I touch this. It's a bad hex perk, so I, I will touch this. Yeah, I should get rid of this. For the good of... Oh. Oh. Oh, there she is. Oh, that's not good. That's not very good at all. Be gone! Be gone, witch! Oh god. That's actually really spooky. <laughs> ah! Why did she one shot me? This killer is OP. Please nerf immediately. <laughs> I had it coming. Oh, come on. Just a fucking more. 10 more seconds. <laughs> Kills Batman! <laughs> Why are you coming? What are you doing? I'm helping you, you stupid idiot. Oh, so that's her nap. Her that's not gonna work. I have the most advanced survivors ever. They would never fall for such disgusting camping. Quickly, get me now, Arctus. She's phasing out. Maybe. Nah, she's still here. All right, you salty idiot. Nice, nice fucking gameplay. Oh, God fucking, God fucking help me. <laughs> nice, she hit me. Thanks. Wait. Wait, she didn't hit me? What? Oh, I guess you don't. All right, guys, do gents, for real though. Dude, I've got adrenaline. I'll. I'll run her for 20 minutes. Oh, where's the fucking pallets, man? Where's the pallets? Where's them pallets? Help me! Help me! Ugh. Oh, that's right. She can't shoot blood. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, Bars, I remember reading about that. Yeah, they have to they have to hit you after you start moving. Alright, what's up? I've been I've been struggling like a motherfucker. I think you can pull it off, but you need to run in front of her. Please, for one second! Actress! I mean, sub serious, you're a piece of shit. 
Nah, he did his best. I'm gonna get camped. You need to do generators, my dudes. You need to- They're not doing a single fucking generator. I could- I could live if they finish them. Oh god. Oh, this works. He's gonna drop him? Really? Really? Oh god. Come on, man. I was- I was nice. I touched your trap. Your stupid obvious trap. Go for it, guys. She's not even using her power. Uh, okay, at least one of them is working on gents. Face camping on the PTV, I know. I know, it's embarrassing. Sub serious, you've got fucking decisive, man. Give me a hand here. What? Alright, now Archus has unbreakable and easy win. Oh. Yeah, I should probably heal me first. I'll go get him with borrow time in a second. That's a bit stupid of them. I love that haze effect. You mean the passive the passive facing? It's really cool. Eistra, welcome. Yet another oh. Yet another, uh, I was gonna say PUBG streamer. Uh, Dead by Daylight streamer you should check out. Uh. Sorry, Arthur, you hang in there for a bit. Sup, go get him, man. Can't camp forever. That is desperation. Uh, Sub is a is a swell guy. Nothing against him. I'm not sure if he's already used the size of. Wow, what an amazing killer! He's gonna go for the save. Is he gonna get the save? That's an interesting question. Oh. Arctus, hang on in there, man. Hang on in there. I'll come and get you. Then she will tunnel me, and then I'll get adrenaline, and we all get out of there. Paradox, welcome to the stream. Pinky promise, man. Pinky promise. Well, we gotta do gens, man. In fact, if we do all gens, I have a key we can escape without even opening any gate. But we gotta be smart about it. All right, whoever's not shit, someone's gotta finish this gen, man. I'll go for Arctis last fucking second, but I'm gonna get fucking tunneled myself right after. They need to hurry up. Somebody needs to come here and help me with this. Oh, they got Arctis. He's gonna go down though. Guys, guys, I need someone here. I'll go and take a, take the heat. Use my adren- Alright, R2 set. Nice! Good save! Run, Arctus! Please tell me he's got adrenaline. He's never gonna run adrenaline. Run! No! Okay, we can body block for him. Oh no, we're fucking stupid. We got baited, like, big time. Uh, anyway. Yeah, fuck, these guys, they were not listening. Yeah, like, how could they have teamwork? Let's look for the hatch. Or find the exit guy? I'll go and help. Damn, I had adrenaline, I should have been out there helping. Basement? Yep. Oh, no. 
this works. Just looking at me right now. We're gonna follow her. <laughs> Run! Into the exit! Does she even know where the exit is? Yeah, nice. Oh fuck! How did this happen? You suck, buddy! Can't get us all. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh. What a sorry killer. I needed self care there. Still, shop, uh, pretty pretty bad play by us. Yeah, he didn't show his power at all. Except, except at the start. That was fun. Will you be uploading a new video in the next week? Yeah, very likely. Run out. They're out. Oops, escape. Nah, I, want, I wanted to see if I could trade for him. But she needed to be an idiot for that to work. This is the new killer? Yep. It's just that if you... Yeah, you wouldn't really see what she's like. Because he played her really poorly. I have to shut up. <laughs> Daily vlogging channel uh, tomorrow. Mm. Can't even get to level five. Just about me. Okay. No, no, we can't do anything. I want to use this diversion perk. I don't care if I have fucking nothing else. Let's see. I gotta go. Let's see. Bye. Bye, Kale. How's the new survivor? He's got a perk that is crazy fucking strong. Oh, man. It's definitely gonna be meta. This deliverance thing? Holy shit. This is, uh, in my opinion, this, uh, don't take me wrong, it's a really cool concept. Uh, kudos to the team for coming up with this fucking crazy idea. But, as a killer, right now, if I see someone go for an hook, I'm gonna immediately fucking destroy the person being unhooked under 10 seconds. I'm not gonna be nice, because if you're nice and you let them have a safe unhook, you basically play into their fucking hands. With this perk. Look, when they get a safe unhook, they, they can escape the, ha uh, the the hook by themselves next time you hook them. If it's their first hook, of course. What's, what's the new killer? Um, uh, I'll show you. It's really cool for us, even if you're not very interested in this game. I'm sure you will appreciate her aesthetics. I'll show you in a second. There she is. Look at her limbs. It's the spirit of a dead girl. Dead Japanese girl. And she can essentially become invisible and travel around without seeing survivors and guess where they're gonna be and then t like materialize and immediately slash them. It's fucking cool. Hi Cosmo. What is a safe unhook? Safe unhook is when you unhook them and the and they don't get down for like ten seconds. Hey, oh. I think you guys are door, you hold four trucks. I'm gonna get you oh. down for ten seconds. Wow, I do. Feels good, man. What <laughs> you do? What? Welcome. Thanks for the thirteen month. Oh. What happened? All right, we're ready. That sounds cool. Um. 
it's gonna be a, it's it's gonna be a really hard to use killer. So that means high skill cap, as Fungo said. How do you get the new killer? Uh, check the developer's Twitter, and they have instructions on how to play on the PTB. The PTB is the public test build, so it's available for everyone. You can play as the killer for free if you get the game already. When the new killer comes out in a week or in two weeks or whatever, you'll have to purchase it for like $7 or something. So what's the broken status do? The broken status is like having no miter. I didn't understand it either, but somebody pointed it out. So what it means is that, you know, you can't immediately heal yourself to like 100. So for, for a while you'll be vulnerable. But st still, the crazy, that's a crazy good perk. Welcome for us. For us. Okay, looks like we're kind of... Oh. Alright, immediately greeted by Phantom Booty. I appreciate this. Oh, we'll just go by ourselves. Did my notification for 13 months go through? Yeah, Fire Tracks. Uh, could you not watch the stream for a second? Yeah, I thanked you. Thank you so much. And Christian, thank you for the host. Welcome. That's a big booty. She's a pretty tiny girl, but yeah, she's kind of scary. All right. I want to see what this new perk does. I'm, I'm so puzzled. The perk deactivates. So you can only use it once? For real? No, you can use it once every 45 seconds, right. Quilla killed me four times in a row and I'm pissed as hell. <laughs> Quilla can be really hard or really difficult or really easy, I feel. Best perk from the new killer survivor? The best perk from the new killer is probably the trap uh, hex totem. It, it spawns two trap hex totems on the map. And if survivors touch either of them, well, Kalen's either of them, they all get exposed, aka no it status, where you can one-shot them for like a minute. Fucking nuts. And the other one is uh, from, the, from the survivor, it's one that lets you unhook yourself 100% uh, of the time, if you get a safe unhook on someone before. It's got, it's got a bit of conditions, and yeah, it's not like for free, but man, it's really strong. So yeah, two new really strong meta perks. Oh, I see the fucking killer. It's by the shack. I'm gonna point her out. So what this killer does, like she will chase us, and then you will see that she suddenly stands still. That's when she's teleporting. Her body remains still, but she actually is like somewhere else. She's already teleporting, she's invisible. So you have to guess where she's gonna be, and she can't see you while she teleports. So you need to not leave scratch marks and so on. Not keep her. Don't give her any uh, hints of your location. Oh, there she is. Really? <laughs> she just kept running? Okay. Oh, okay. She's on me. She hit me really badly. Ouch. Alright. <laughs> this is alright. Ah! No! That was really good. I thought I was on the pallet. She blocks the way with her body. This is probably like the best fucking place to use this power at. Good job. Oh no, the basement's here! No, it's not. Okay, we're fine. Hey, it just made nice. What? Is she just a good wraith? Yep, pretty much. Just why? Eight months. Thank you. Eight months worth of two tier subs? Tier two subs? That's really nice. Thank you. Just bad. Altus for Luigi. <gasps> Run, Frank Bean! 
They should have her speed be regular speed, in all honesty. You mean while she's phasing or while she's moving normally? She's already normal speed when she moves normally, I think. There you go. I'm gonna get so fucking comped. Hey, David. Buddy. Oh, God. Oh, God. God, why? Leave me alone, man. What have I done to you? Oh, fuck. Ah, you piece of shit. Man, we're not having the nicest killers today. Are we? I just want to test this new bird. What do I do when I get diagnosed with death? Look at them. She's literally just face camping me, isn't she? She just moved, okay. I thought I still heard the heartbeat. Wow. Diagnosed with death? I don't know, man. Maybe you should buy some Mustafa merch. That will help. What's the pebble do? It makes a little notification. Now it seems kind of fucking useless, because it's the only perk I have. <laughs> so I'm dying here. Wow. Wow. Incredible job, killer. Incredible job. You're about to kill one fucking person. Uh, thanks, guys. They're doing well. They're actually doing well. Yeah, she's, she's back to camping me, I think. Hey, man, you might want to come for me right now. That is fucking embarrassing. She's blocking the way. She can't go through. <laughs> nice, now you can. Alright, I'm gonna run. Oh, we'll make it? Oh, this Fang Min just saved my ass. Quickly, let's go. Save the other guy. We'll do it, we'll do it, we'll do it. I tried, I really tried, David. I'm gonna die for you. Yeah, she's chasing me. Maybe not. Do I have my perk ready? Left out. Okay, I have it ready. We could try it. Right, so when we see her coming, we can try to do something. Oh, fuck. It's only 10 meter, though. Damn. Let me see if my survivor's bodies can carry me a bit more. I could throw it at a window or something to, like, bamboozle the killer. I guess this is a thing that she can hear from... Oh. bad man it was really bad maybe she's got nurses or something we need to complete that gem though yeah. right let's see if we can use this All right let's try to use this Now we run in the opposite direction. And maybe, maybe we'll see the killer pop up over there. Did it work? Nope, probably didn't. I'm so useless, Mike. 
my my one power in this fucking trial is to throw one fucking stone. That is pathetic. I'm gonna throw a second stone. Though. Oh fuck! I kind of forgot what her power was all about. I'm being, I'm being the worst kind of survivor right now. Doing fucking nothing. I don't know where gens are though. Feels bad for this fucking thing, man. She's literally getting face comped. Should I just go for the save? I die immediately then. You know what? Fuck it. Oh god, that's bad. Run, Fangman. I'm dead for you. Nobody else would do it. Save hook rescue. <laughs> Thanks. That could be really useful. You need to stand perfectly still. That takes a while. I don't think you're supposed to throw it mid chase. I think you're supposed to throw it right before it begins, maybe. Or when you have a bit of a break in between. This is too difficult, man. We can't we can't test these perks without a proper build, especially with dickheads. <laughs> like this one. Insidious. For real. That's interesting. I think that's a very nice thing to do. Yeah, Shim, I've been approached by people who are like, oh, sign this petition uh, to make a statue. I don't know if that's the most appropriate thing. I don't even know if the family is okay with it or, or anything. So I've been, I've been kind of quiet. It would be pretty sweet in his memory. Yeah, that's true. All right, guys. Let me check something. I'm gonna see if someone else, one of my friends, is playing this game or something. We can, we can give them a raid. I'm gonna call it a day for now. That was kind of fun. Aura's playing. Is that fucking Pokemon on my Twitch? We're gonna give Aura a raid. He's playing this. I don't know. I'm pretty low energy. Before we do that, you guys wanna see that thing? I promise the. <laughs> The preview of the video. I'll try to show it to you guys. It's a very, very short one. Because I just rendered this one for, uh, for a little test. But you might like it. Alright, more soon. That's probably gonna be the intro for the video. <laughs> PUBG's in a really fun place right now. Is that Harry? That's that's Idubs. So it's, it's a funny, it's a funny guy, a famous YouTuber. He just made a a green screen thing. <laughs> if you play PUBG, you would get the joke. Uh, nowadays on PUBG, there's like a million bots spamming advertisements in Chinese for like hacks and cheats and stuff. And it's really, really unpleasant when you go into a lobby. <laughs> We're gonna give a raid to Ouroboros. Send him all my love. I'm pretty low energy today. I think I want to go back to editing. It was cool to check the killer out. Unfortunately, we can't really play very effectively on either side. So we'll give it a shot. We'll play some more 
later in the week or something. See ya tomorrow then? Very likely, yes. But until then, I'll leave you guys with Aura. Send him all the love. In well, actually, no, don't do that. Uh, tell him he's a dickhead. Do whatever you want. But he's a cool guy. He can take it. See you tomorrow, guys. Bye.